cube. Well, you've come to the right place. Yarnum is the home of blood ministration. You've come to the right place. Shut up. Bloodborne, we're back. I gotta make my boy Tony. Tony. Uh mature. Mm-hmm. Man, what kind of run to do? Um, hmm. Traditional saw clear. S you know, I never roll with the saw spear. I'm gonna try a saw spear run. Um, I'll try a saw spear run. What's up, Brit? How's it going? You've waited forever to do ee! Perfect. Your time has come. It is now. Excellent. Is that Glorp? Saw, wait, sp not Saw Cleaver, wait, Saw, Saw Spear, right, yeah. <laughs> Tonitris, yeah. Mr. Domino, thanks for 16 months. Odin the War God, 65 m months. Let's go. Let's freaking go. Hey, pizza. No rest for the wicked hype. Does that come out today or what? We glorping? I hope so. Any glorpers in the chat? All signed and sealed. All signed and sealed. Oh, man. Look at that cinematic frame rate. Of course. Of course. Hit on show 47 months. Welcome back. We're gonna go for a saw spear run. I just haven't played this game in a sense the slow run, I think. Um Actually No, probably since May, I think. Oh god. Bad start. There we go. Oh man. Ooh, man. Still got it. Uh, probably since May last year. It's probably the last time I played Bloodborne. I like to guess. That's uh, way too long. I'm on PS5. Um, this rookie looks amazing. I'm playing so I have no money to buy a Brazil present. Hmm. Yeah. I would, I would expect KCD too, but you never know. You never know. Maybe it's a whole other IP or something. Hinan Show, is it May yet? Almost. Not quite. Warming up. Heinrich, 55 months. How are you? Last year, Lobro gave me the cane. Uh, I like the cane. Later game, once you get a million skill, then you crit everything for 8 million. KCD is Kingdom Come Deliverance. <laughs> Kingdom Came Deliverance, that's right. You're playing this for the ninth time currently as well? This is my 900th time. Probably. 555 starting blood echoes, huh? Um. Too late, dude. Man, this game. This game. So it's an itch to do chalice gem farming among a billion other games. Mm -hmm. Conquers 32, 40 mines. Welcome back. Oh. Chels and Duck Ale, welcome back. Foul beast. <laughs> now I'm waking up. Occasional Spoonerism. Gifted a sub to ice cream liquor. Nice. Heck yeah. Uh, Saw Spear is more, more dexy, I think, right? But I'm still taking Saw Spear. 
for starters. I don't, I don't think I'll ever take blunderbuss unless it's a challenge. Spallus, thanks for five gifts. Thanks, Spallus. Dex with the option to arcane element it hard. So basically not arcane on first playthrough, right? I don't know. I feel like elemental stuff, you gotta really gotta be NG plus. Or at least really late game to make that work. Oh. I think they addressed this the other day. They don't actually own the rights. Oh, wait. Oh, you're talking about Bloodborne PC. No, yeah. Bloodborne is a PlayStation seller for them. I'm sure we'll see. I'm sure we'll see Bloodborne remake on the PS6 when that comes out. <clears throat> it's Sony published, not Bandai or Activision. They're greedy. They want to keep it for themselves. Transform button, huh? Oh god. Oh god. How do I hit box? Triangle to heal. Rally. So nice. I enjoyed the voice acting in KCD. Interesting. TFW we didn't get the Bloodborne cart. I mean, did you see Nightmare cart? I think that's out soon, actually. Very, very, very soon. Like right before May. Oh, I can't grab this. I can't swim. Huh? Beezles! Thanks for getting the sub to Wildcat Killer. Oh. Ow. Got him. Gun. What is the dog? There he is. Ow. One to loot in Rise of the Ronin. <laughs> what? Well, I guess it wouldn't be Bloodborne without accidental motion gestures. Whoever tested the motion gestures really did not have shaky leg syndrome, you know. That's all I'm doing is shaking forever. Shaky legs. Give me your bullets. Good. Nice time to just take a seat. Yeah, you bet. This town's Finnish? Really? Oh, I didn't know it was Finland. Of course, Ken Coldblood. Here from the beginning on the, for the Bloodborne runs. Ken Coldblood do. Uh. Your sister is a shaker and drives you to the brink of insanity. Just learn to shake. Not only sure while blank Dark Souls 2, but sometimes barely can hear who me? What's up, Dr. Ulden? How's it going? Whoops. BL Sizzle. Funnily enough, I was rewatching your modded Bloodborne runs yesterday. I love this game. Yes. Oh, yes. Dogs. Dogs. Game is very loud compared to me. Oh. Very well. 
sounds good in my ears, but uh, definitely different on different listening devices and setups. That's right, game isn't loud enough. Oh, oh god, so dark. Mm, I think, let me see if the balance is still right. Yes, yes it is. Music's gonna be very nice. You're watching the arcane run? Broccoli Man? Oh god. Hmm. Upgrade? Nah. I still gotta run around and collect things. <laughs> yeah, the monocular aim only run or whatever. Does Bloodborne have my favorite music? Hmm. It's got a lot of very good music. I don't know if I would say it's my favorite. It's just hard to say because there's the more games we get in the oh god, the bigger games we get, they have so much more music in them. So I bet most people you ask would that would be their answer. Wait. Ow. <laughs> What's up, Taha? How's it going? I wouldn't call this clean shaven, but definitely shave. Oh. I got a lot of fuzz. Tax evading giraffe. Zaraki. Welcome back. I never tried a No Hunter's Dream Challenge run. Nope. Bloodborne's definitely one of your top OSTs. It's extraordinarily good. Um. I want to go up, I think. Well, we want to go get the saw spear, right? Because that's what we're using for this run. Saw spear. Dogs. Thanks, Aswin. Blood boner. Oh. Ishin the Saint gifted a sub to Portable Jerk Gobs. Thanks, Ishin. I want to play Sekiro again, too. I don't think I've... Mm, I don't think I've played Sekiro since... Sakiro In November? <sighs> there start to be so many more games that... It's hard to pay attention to them all. Equally. What's up, Yilva? I don't have plans for No Rest for the Wicked today, no. It's kind of hard to fit... Uh, what? Hey. Fit Good that into Aaron. my schedule. But it depends on if I... What? Up? What? Rush up? through and finish... What? Rush through and finish Rise of the Ronin sooner. Or just... I don't know, it's kind of weird because there have been so many op big open world games lately that take so long to play through that I love and I want to finish, but I don't want to like do my super thorough in-depth playthrough because I have so many other things that I want to do. But then I don't want to rush through it either because then that's not really playing the game. So I don't know. It's a tough situation. Tough situation. I've thought about like no open world games on stream, but then no, because some of them I really want to play on stream. So it's a great problem to have. In some ways, yes. In other ways, less. Oof. Raiders, what's up, Violet Shade? How's it going? Give me your blood. Good thing they have standardized blood vials. Oh.
There's a leap, right? Yeah. Of course there's a leap. Ooh. What's up, Takansar? Mitchell, what's up? Uh, I've only played like an hour of Enshrouded, and it was mostly just to help test a server for Bloody. Um, but no, that's definitely a game I'm super interested in. But I also don't have any urgency to play it because it's all it's early access and it's a survival game and they'll just keep building on it. So, yeah, when I get to it, I'm really excited to play it. Uh, right, and he hop down. I want to say this side's a saw spear. Get out! Get out of your rats! <laughs> Never remember that. <laughs> oh, it's... I, I was on a different side than I thought. Well, I need to go all the way back around. I want to use this so that the doll is active next time I go back. I think even a single person ever remembers what side is on. I mean... If you get the bloodstone shards as part of a speedrun, you would definitely remember. <laughs> because you would do it so many times and then... It would be a time waste otherwise to not... Yeah, the bloodstone shards, yeah. But, I say that. And I go for them pretty much every time just for the bloodstone shards. So the side nearest the oh the entrance to this room is the wait. Are, wait, did everything respawn? I'm confused. Oh god, I'm dead. Wait. I thought I cleared out this room. I guess not. Mm. Speedrunners aren't people, they're machines. I mean, I've done speedruns, I'm not a machine. Confused and dead. Man, the load times. Wait a minute. Does that do that on first death when you have a no madman's knowledge? I don't remember that. <laughs> Forgot what it was like to die in this game. Nice. Uh, oh, and I didn't even loot it, so I can't upgrade it. All right. The word on Bloodborne for PC? Literally nothing. They've never even insinuated that they're putting Bloodborne on PC. The community and everyone else just... thirst for it. Sony's bleeding money every day this game isn't on PC. And they like it. Erontian plays 16 months. Gamer can party 31 months. I'm telling you, they're they're doing Bloodborne remake for PS6 seller. Demon Souls remake was a PS5 seller. Uh Bloodborne remake PS6 seller. If they put it on PC, you won't need to buy it for PS6. You won't need to buy a PS6. Oh, wait. Uh. Hate that you're probably right. Look. Just be a true fan and buy another PS4 to jailbreak it and then do modded Bloodborne runs. Oh. Yet another avenue for them to sell consoles for jailbreaks. <laughs> Even if... Oh, God. Hello? Is the other guy after me? I, I think I... Yeah, yeah. Oh god, oh god. Stop! 
Stop. Stop yelling. Stop. I should have got my blood echoes back before uh, I started fighting these idiots. You're an idiot. Well, I should have just hit my parry. There we go. Thank you. Oh, no, no. Come here. Damn it. Damn it, dude. <laughs> Holy shit. And this is why door cheese is nice. <laughs> What's up, Chris? Oh. Ow. FF sixteen. Ow. Give me some blood. Thank you. Oh wait, did the other one fall through the world? God, they always do that. It's fine. It's fine. You always door cheese them. Yeah, I couldn't finish FF16 on stream. It just the pacing was not was not there for me. And even though I love Soken and I love the cinematic stuff, it's just not for me for a video game. Like I would love to see a movie. Like Kingsglaive. Of FF16. But. Couldn't finish it. Uh, yeah. Henry's armor. Parries are all slightly too late. Just slightly. What game early release are you hyped for the most this year? Uh, ow. I don't even know. I'd have to look at a list. I mean, there's Elden Ring DLC, of course. Stellar Blades out in eight days. Crap. The demo is very good for that. Oh no. I don't really, I don't really keep tabs on what's coming out and when, because chat is always like, "Are you gonna play this?" And I'm like, "Oh, is that out soon?" And then. That's how I know. Um, Dawn Trail. Oh, is, that's Final Fantasy. Right? DD2 was great. I was very happy to play DD2. Where did I die before? Oh, yeah, I remember now. Shut up. You and your stupid hat. What are you doing alive? Thank you. KCD2 is Kingdom Come Deliverance 2. Kingdom Come. Ow. Ow. Wait, I don't think the... Shard's down here. Yeah. Oh, I went through him. Yes. Hello, off duty Bill. TCG videos? Oh, trading card. Nice. 
Is there any lore for those weird handsy things? Ow. Ow. What, these? Just a, a British alley on the Monday, right? Everybody's all hung over and stuff. Oh, this is a full run. This is a full run. Yeah, it sucks that it's going to be, for the YouTube video, it's going to be split up, but maybe I'll just keep it all one video. Right, I can confirm it's true. Yeah, YouTube can skip past KCD too. Not in real time, of course, but on the VODs. Hold on. No. Austin AFK, how's it going? Ooh. Very nice. All right, very nice. Okay, let's go get our souls. I'm just gonna call them souls. Dogs are gonna be out. Oh, maybe not. Not yet. I'm playing Bloodborne on my Bloodborne machine. Uh, my Bloodborne Stellar Blade Rise of the Ronin Demon Souls remake machine, among other things. Shadow of the Colossus machine. My plan for the run is Saw Spear. That's it. Zoo. Never use this because I always just consider it worse saw cleaver. We've done a Migdalen arm run. It's not good. <laughs> Human boy name. Sauce beer run. Yes. Quiet. Thank you for the reset. Okay, I think that's it. Isn't sauce beer good for skill build? Yes. Well, it scales more in skill. Pretty much anything is good for skill build, though, because if you're doing parries and backstabs, skill boosts that crit damage. And then saw the, the safe. Beast, beast safe or something? Oh, wait, one. Is that one more skill? Wait, where did I die? Oh, it was the upper part before I dropped down. Crap. I gotta go back there. Find who has my, uh, my Blekos. There is no Bloodborne remaster. Terminal Core, 21 months. Welcome back. Thanks, guys. Thanks for the gunshots. Appreciate it. Yep, just slightly too late. No! Ruined. Are you serious? I, I hate this. Um, Gunmans! Gunmans! Jesus. Let me kill the gunmans. <sighs> yeah, this really feels like Saw Cleaver. <laughs> Different. 
Yeah, the safe R1 is cool, but it'll mess me up a lot because my positioning will be... Like, I'll position myself without the expectation of being <laughs> charged forward every time I start a combo. But it's not, it's not too hard to deal with. Hello. Ah, oh, there he is. Give. Delicious. You le yeeted yourself off the stairs in research hall with a safe. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I just want to get back. Well, I suppose I'll grab this. Ooh, nice. I do not usually get that one. Because it's usually out of the way. Andrew, five bucks over on YouTube. Thank you. Let's celebrate their fifth super chat on a live stream. Whoa. It counts them. All right, get out of here. I don't want any is. I'm gonna go upgrade the saw cleaver and level. I mean the saw spear, shit. The saw spear. Drop mania, hello. Hello, whoa. How are you? What's up, barbarian? You never seen this game. This is Roblox. Um, Nightmare Hunter Edition. Spear Cleaver. Because you're playing any AC6 DLC if it were to come out, I wouldn't even consider it. I would just do it. Yeah, you shouldn't get any ads on as a as a subscriber over on Twitch.com. Still dead. It's whispering. Somebody's whispering. Hello, tired cuties. All right. All right. Is an RPG mod for Bloodborne cart? Right. Heck yeah. Man, I do want to play AC Six again too. <clears throat> The music's so good. It's the whole experience. Very nice. Uh, saw spear. Nice. Hmm. I can also buy black ones. I mean, buy blood vials. Blyles. Blyles. Let me check this real quick. Farewell, good. D D D. Okay. <laughs> Welcome. Uh, good. Very well. Uh, sure. Get some skill. Fair. Nice, Ishin. Hey, Grinsane, how's it going? You got the worst ending of AC6 on your first go, and it felt awful. I mean, it's kind of built so that you do multiple new games, and there's also new. Uh, New missions on NG Plus and NG Plus 2, I think. Or new uh, branching paths as well. So you're kind of meant to play through it multiple times. A mod for AC6 that lets you dual wield melee weapons? Probably. There's a, uh, there's a mod for seamless co-op and PvP as well. Invasion, PvP invasions. <laughs> Um, doing your second playthrough at the moment? Nice. Nice. It's a good game. Kami Kolo, 33 months. Welcome back. This is a Saw Spear run. I, I sh I'm sure I've done a Saw Spear run before, but I just... It was never something I really thought about because... As I mentioned, I have always considered it just to be worse Saw Cleaver. But, uh, doesn't mean it's bad, just worse. <laughs> Do 
AC6 got some new remix tracks in the OST that aren't in the game. Really, huge bangers. It's so dark. Let's go do Cleric Beast. First boss time. Crank the music. Hey guys. Nicely timed. Oh. Fully intentional, definitely. Not this time. Spear is serrated in both forms, whereas blade is serrated in one. So that's why it deals less damage over him. Just kidding. Clean. Clean more than can be said for your character. Hey, I'm clean now. Took my bath. Big dork energy. Fun fact. Here's your fun fact. Oh. Mm. Art. Hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. We've done a lot of these by this point. Um. Okay, here's facts about deadly predators. The Siberian tiger hunts where temperatures can drop to minus 40 degrees. Both, both Fahrenheit and Celsius. Their powerful muscles can launch them 20 feet in one leap. Good job, Siberian tiger. Stay warm, buddy. Anonymous gifted a sub to Dallin Rex. Enjoy that sub, Dallin. Thanks, Anonymous. Welcome. What? Very well, let Thank you very much. 
It's a return to a wonderful game, Tebs. I don't think I've played this since May of last year. I think. I could be wrong. Um, by the old pungies. Fact was about Siberian tigers and how they hunt in negative 40 degrees Celsius and Fahrenheit. And that they can jump 20 feet. Nightmare 5981. Yeah, let's go here. Thanks for 17 months. Did you know that there are beasts all over the shop? Oh, shit. You'll be one of them sooner or later. Cleric Beast has nothing on the Siberian Tiger. Well... I don't know about that. Paladin beast, a rogue beast, and a bard beast. Ah. A barb beast as well. Ow. Ow. My face. Oh, yeah. One shot's now. Hey, Gone Hollow. Thanks for nine months. What's up, Jason? Good morning to you. Renor and Aim. Welcome back, my friends. Ball. Easy. Okay. Oops. I just tried to deflect. <laughs> Thanks all the new games that have deflection in them. There will be snipey in an hour and a half, I think. Cross be praised. Nice. Old hunter marks. Did I not get shake off cape? How come I didn't get shake off cape? I don't. Oh, wait, where is it? There we go. Oh, I did get shake off cape. Oh, perfect. Good. <laughs> it's not a bloodborne run for me if I don't have shake off cape. All right, let's go. Let's go. all over the shop. You'll be one of them sooner or later. <laughs> Such nice, nice teeth. <laughs> Who's this chum? <laughs> Saradzik. Sarazic from the company of oh, from the company of Sarazic and Kamala. Oh God. Oh. Oh. Hold on. Wait. Oops. Wrong button. Wrong button. That was the absolutely the wrongest button. There was. Ha, 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 ha. 
<laughs> Hilarious. Ow. Sickness. <laughs> and close. Jedi! 81 months. Welcome back. I'm doing a saw spear build. Not a usual weapon choice for me. <gasps> Slasat! Welcome back to the Wolf Pack on YouTube. Thank you, Slasat. Hey, Dinky Bird. So that was almost your whole first day of gameplay when this came out. He, uh, I feel like he effed up a lot of us first playthroughs. Blood gem. Oh. Saw spear? Oh, uh, yeah, how do you think I needed to pick it up? You could feel the spear. And I haven't watched a lot of these cutscenes in a long time. I probably watched them for the slow run, though. Oh. Betaverse, welcome back. Pouring out, pouring one out for Papa Gas Coin. This point is some bloodstone shard acquisition. Recover some blood vials. Easiest to parry enemies ever. Oh. Oh. No blood vials. What the fuck? Bought a PS4 just so you could play this game, but you got lost in the Forbidden Woods and gave up, and then you sold it to your ex-sister-in-law. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We are all living failure, failures compared to Glorp. All hail Glorp. Oh. Oh. oh no, 
That's all you do? No, he does other stuff. He dies. <laughs> I don't... There's not... They don't... Do any of the other games have enemies explode and blow your clothes when they die? <laughs> this is, uh... Oh, yeah, okay. Hello, Cthulica. Well, they blow up. They go... And then your clothes go... In the wind. Yeah, Norma, not every single May of every single year. That's what we're we're coming up on May. It's almost St. Jude month. We've done some planning. Grimrock has made us an insane mod. If you did not see it, uh, I mean we haven't played it yet, so we don't know exactly. But he posted details about it on Twitter, and it seems ridiculous. Out. I don't remember if we have a command for that. Oh. Bonk. God. May soon approacheth. Yes. Is that it, metric? Thank you. Oh, birds. Ow, ow, ow. Damn it. I keep pressing up to heal. That's not how you do it. That's Rise of the Ronin most recently. Oh. Get this bad boy. Uh, yeah. Nice. Bye. Oh god. Oh god. Ooh. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. I missed this game, so finally I'm playing it for the first game. <laughs> first time, haha. <laughs> no, I didn't miss it that much. Missed entirely. I need the lantern. It's dark. Ronin bot. Press F to throw flares. I need to play Deep Rock Galactic. Captain Canada, 18 months. Welcome back. Please hold. Do you think I, there will ever make 60 FPS 4K support ever? I've always been saying that they consider Bloodborne a console seller, and so Sony is going to wait, possibly invest in... I mean, if they did go through with purchasing Bluepoint, then they could just be like, hey, Bluepoint, make a remake, and then we'll sell it on PlayStation 6. And then, uh, thanks. I don't know if that would be 60 FPS 4K, but I would expect, I guess, so. No problem. You'd like to apologize for cheesing my Convergence NPC yesterday. In which game? That might be a spoiler. I may not have seen that before. I don't remember if, if there was one in DS3. I only played DS3 Convergence once. It was a long time ago. A long time ago. Pistola. Blood jam. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm in the DS3 kit. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember that now. I do remember that. Hey, Coil Fade, how's it going? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Mm, oh, wait. Dang it, I could have bought gas coin stuff now. I was thinking... Oh, well, whatever. Hello. Well, okay, Welcome let's talk. home. What is it you desire? Very well. Let me stand close. No wonder we kill her every time. More skill. Is this skill scaling Very yet? Well, good hunt. Well, more skill scaling. Does it become more skill? D D D. 
someday, someday. You just finished watching the Bloodborne Enemy Onslaught playthrough. This feels cozy now. Oh, very cozy, yes. We're going to do a randomizer Bloodborne run for May this year. I didn't last year. It It's... Every time I do, like, a randomizer thing, I have to remember how to uh, mod around the jailbreaked console, and there's a lot of, like, moving files on the rem uh, removal removable drives and then replacing files. I always have to re-remember how to do it. But once I remember, it's not so bad. But we'll mod it, and we'll have the 60 FPS mod on there. Even though if we, in a lot of cases, the FPS will drip, drip, drop, dip, dip and drop. Because their enemies are in bad places, not optimized, but still. Ah, 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 holy jeebs. Gun him. Yeah, shoot that dog. Using Prime is more hidden again. You mean they don't want to just give away money for free? Drip drop. Clip. Plop. Splish. Splash. Hello. Oh. No. Uh, I would like to play No Rest for the Wicked. We'll see if I, if there is time before May. UPS at the door. Oh. Taking Max Copium for 10th anniversary? What, Bloodborne Remaster or something? Yeah, you're at... <laughs> I don't think anybody here knows the answer about a uh, remaster or remake for this game, but. Take this. Take this. this. Oat Bran. 18 months. Good to see you playing Bloodborne again. Good to be playing. Good to be playing Bloodborne again. I need the lantern. I'm gonna get that lantern. Faulty wires, 8 bit sub variable. 128. Satisfying. Remember stressfully downloading the Bloodborne demo? It had a demo? I don't remember Bloodborne demo. Hello. It did? Did I play it? A network test? You go up to Cleric Beast? Interesting. I must have played it, surely. I know I, I skipped on the Elden Ring network test because I was like, no spoilers. Uh, I remember playing DS3 network test because I... Um, met up with Ouroboro and we had the torch in our offhand and we were doing this this animation but I don't remember Bloodborne Network to... that's where Gascoigne says Umbasa oh shit I went out to something for DS3 well yes but I also still played in the network test Zoo. Ah, uh, oh, I want to grab these, I think. Oh, I guess. And something I wanted to do. What did I want to do while I'm out here? Not buy Gascoin's armor. Not level. Molotovs. 
Upgrade? No. Gems? No. What did I want to do? <laughs> no idea. I don't have the tool. Hmm. Well, I don't remember. Oh, lantern! Yes! Right! <laughs> nice. The hand lantern. Of course. Ooh. Uh, uh. One second. Mmm. One second. Grabbing a chainsaw real quick.
Okay, sorry. I'm here. Uh, yeah, we, we bought a chainsaw, because... We've been doing some... Land management. IRL survival craft. Chainsaw has a controller run. No, chainsaw acquired. Ubex, 12 months, welcome back. Land management, yes. Our friend has land, and we are clearing space and creating... Um, LARP. A, a LARP location. Because <laughs> I've been LARPing a lot. And we got a group of friends, and we're like, you know what, let's do our own LARP thing. And our friend has like, you know, like 150 acres in Oklahoma, so... We went out there and we were clearing brush, we camped out, we were cut, chopping down old trees, that sort of thing, so. With the intent of creating a space to host LARP events. So we'll see how that goes. But it was fun. Well, good, good time. Good time. I got 150 acres that quickly. I didn't purchase the land, it's not mine. Um, Let's see. Blood vials. I want to say stuff. You'd love to go camping in Horsefuck Valley. I don't think you would. I don't think you would. Sirid! The Yarnum Town Council invite you to the most courteous manner. Uh, in the most courteous manner to keep away from our town. Thanks in advance. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. It was awesome, Zombri. It was a good time. Lantern. There. We so much light. I guess. It, it, it seems better. Okay. Now I know where I'm at. Dear hunter, stay away. Love. Other hunter. You there! Hunter! Didn't you turn all the other Shut up. Shut up. Yeah. No, it's not diminished iframes anymore. It was initially. Or actually, it was. What it was was reduced stamina regen. If you had the lantern on. But they removed that. I don't think it's reduced eye frames, though. Chat smells. Chat smells? Well, I sure hope they do. That's an important sense to have. To be able to smell things, like when there's fire and tainted blood. Good for you, chat. Thanks for the 500 bits, Ballas. Ow. Ooh. The tempering blood. Saucebeer is your waifu. Interesting. There's more. Hmm, I don't really need these anymore. To my knowledge, there's bloodstone shards here. Yeah. Yeah. Nope. 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 Got plenty of dims. You are a skilled hunter. Adept. Merciless. Half cut with blood. That's the best arm. Tacos? Oh, now I'm hungry. What the heck? Which is why I must stop you. Very well. Stop me then. Hmm. Oh, shit. Almost forgot. More stone shards. Damn. Yep. Pebble. Yep. Not eyeballs. Yeah, I, I really like the look of No Rest for the Wicked. I love the Ori games as well. Uh, I don't. I didn't have plans to play it today. I didn't know it was launching today, but soon. Dot JPEG. Probably. I'll give it a go. 
we'll try and squeeze it in the schedule. It's uh, it's always a challenge. I don't know what Withering Rooms is. Although I might have seen that. Oh shit, he's gonna gun me. Oh, I gotta do it to him. This lantern really doesn't do very much, does it? Kadaju! I've missed watching you kill nightmarish creatures too. Yeah, it's good to be back. 118 months tier 3 subscription. Kadaju the goat. You're all the goat. Ready? Poor guy. Poor guy. Monster! Did I ever beat the Onslaught mod? Uh, well, it was never fully updated. If you're talking about the run where Orphan, we got to Orphan, but Orphan wasn't tripled or whatever. Uh, was it, was that what it was? Something like that. Not everything was done. Um, but uh, it was a good run. It was tough. I remember, what was it? Triple Maria? Was it Triple Maria? Probably just double, right? Uh, that, that was a rough, that was a rough one. Do I think I could beat Triple Orphan? That's, I'm going to have to call the FBI on you for that one. But, um... <clears throat> but yes, I think I could beat Triple Orphan. Uh oh. Neil Giraffe Tyson. Triple Maria sounds like a perfect dream. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. A dream, not a nightmare, right? Oh, I missed the ribbon. Shit. I think you can drop here and forget. Oh, shit. I always loved being able to rally back fall damage. Because I feel like the... The lore or whatever for rally is more like... You took a hit, but you're like invigorated by malice or vengeance. And so when you return a hit, it's like, yeah, and you're, you're kind of revitalized a little bit. But then if it's gravity, you're just like, yeah, take that gravity. Oh, shit. I got to do it to him, too. Got to do it. Got to do it. To him. Oh. Did they fix him? There's no way they fixed him. Hold on. Actual Diagra? Nope. like stuck doing some random shit. Hold on. Hold on. Come. I'm still here. Yeah. Hey, you see me? Oh. Software update. And boom goes the dynamite. No real reason to do that. It's just fun. 
I always love little things like that. Hello. Please don't Windows noise. You're remoted into your servers currently. Sorry, that was... Elgato was like, there's an update for Elgato. Windows noise. Who knows, control scheme? Nobody. Nobody knows. Bl Beast Blood Pellet. Pellet's so good. Smash. Uh-oh. Uh, some fire paper over here. It is a casual vanilla playthrough with a uh, saw spear. Professional vanilla playthrough. That's right. I'm a professional. What's up, Marek? How's it going? Watch the No Hit Run of DS3 where the NVIDIA app prompted update on the Gale fight, kicking the player out of the game. Ooh. That happened. I remember uh, the first time the first time I was fighting Gale, it did that. You know, like, your license has expired <laughs> and kicked me out of the Gale fight. Oh. Hardest DLC fight ever. Yeah. Yeah. Let's see here. Give me some tape. Sure. Let, let's, let's try this. Um, I don't think it's going to go well. I don't. I never practiced this, but maybe it will. Whoops. Oops. That wasn't a very good throw, was it? Oh. there now. Go get it. Go get it, boy. Uh, okay. <laughs> Thumeru. Thumeru. That's another way to do that fight. Yeah. Yeah. Poor guy. Fair and well fought. What you talking about? 59 months, welcome back. Cirrus Wolf. I miss Bloodborne too. Uh, thank you so much, Cirrus Wolf. Welcome back as well. Now. Farewell, good hunt. Scary boss for a first time player? Yeah. I think that was a boss that I killed really quickly on first playthrough. And then the second playthrough was a wall for me. Because that's just how blood. No, that's how from soft bosses work sometimes. RNG dictates it uses like relatively easy to respond to attacks on the first go. But then the next playthrough, it's like. <laughs> you don't get that lucky. I 
think I par I think I parried in my first playthrough. Lobro not seeing the house on fire. Oh. It's fine. I don't think it's something. It <laughs> ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. There's only so much of, with, 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 a, with a playthrough like we were doing with Lobro, it's like the places where you pay attention are mostly the combat, not necessarily the downtimes. The rest of the time you're interacting with chat. Ooh. Nice. Oh, it's almost Warhorse reveal time. And I'm just gonna mix that into the the Bloodborne video, so don't we have to we don't have to stop it, and then it's like a goddamn wrong button. <laughs> a non-continuous thing. Tips to defeat Blood Starved Beast. Well, if you don't want to do like I just did here, what I recommend is getting right up against him and just circling around him tightly. A lot of his abilities, he will not turn to face you very well. So you circle round, hit him in the butt. I think that's actually when I first, we first started doing circle round, hit him in the butt. Was Blood Starved Beast, as far as tactics goes. Parry the heck out of it. Well, I don't recommend that if you're trying to do it, because you, I mean, you can, absolutely. But also you can, fail to parry the grab and get one shot and that's I wouldn't tell a new player to do that well that's that's the uh, the tactic that I just did was the pungent blood clock cocktail cheese but if you don't want to kill him like that circle round hit it in the butt and you'll start to learn how long his recovery times are for different attacks some of them you can just go like, do a full charge R2 into a backstab. Aw, oh, man. I'm missing what? Let's do Ash and Hunter set. Oh. No pants. No pants, no dance. Oh, right, because I couldn't afford them. Hmm. <laughs> Jura. It's hard to mod a PS4 to play the 60 FPS version. A little bit... Especially if you're not familiar with, like, modding files standardly on PC. You also, it's also expensive. Uh, unless you jailbreak a PS4 that you have that you don't use anymore, in which case. But the thing about that is you have to have an unupdated, well, it's hard to say. They might have better, they might have the, um, strats for, wait, oh, it's the third one. Strats for modding n newer version PS4s these days. But for me, when I did my PS4, I had to buy a specific firmware version. You cannot update. Firmware 9.0 or worse, as far as you know now. I don't know about that. Um, am I going to do any chalices today? Hmm. I could. I could. Chalices are fun. You want to return to Yarnum. Yeah, you can't down downgrade firmware. That's the that's the, the the hard part about it. Modding it means you cannot play online. And again, it cannot it basically cannot have been online ever. I had to buy like a Call of Duty PS4 bundle uh, brand new which was like, you know, even more because it was a bundle and it was kind of rarer. But you can find uh you can find like Reddit threads and or guides that will tell you exactly what you need and probably probably better ways to do it these days. Um hard to say. But I still got my PS4 right here. My jailbroken PS4. I only ever use it for Bloodborne mod runs. 
But it's gonna get its use this May. You bet your booty. Um, Bloodborne is a single player game anyway. Controversy. Yeah, I don't know. I haven't tried to do any PS5 jailbreak stuff. I think Dist. I think Dist did. PS5 jailbreak with 60 FPS mod would be even smoother. But honestly, I did 60 FPS PS4. Oh, and it's quite good. It's it's pretty darn good. We yeah. When do I get runes? Oh, the witches. What's up, Pokemon Legend? In how you doing? Oh, Dist tried to buy one on eBay, but they never responded. At after Dist paid. What the hell? Yeah, 720 60 FPS uh, PS PS4. Yeah. Oh. One at a time, please. No! Whoa! <laughs> Snuck it. Ow. What's up, Off Kainson? What is bad? He didn't pay. He said the guy never got back, right? Oh. Well, I don't know. By the way, I thought Dist had done it, but I guess not. Could be worth look. I mean, PS5 is still very expensive and newer. Not new, but newer. And so I don't, I don't know if it'd be worth for me to do if I've already got it all set up on PS4. PS4 emulators. Ooh. Haven't I haven't tr followed that at all? All right, let's see here. I do love this boss. You can fix her? Okay. So that the world might be mended. Wait. The wife, sure, yeah. Slay Proddard. Proddard. What do I think about Death Stranding? I only played, uh, like, I don't know, eight hours or so of that Master game. Master Willem, I've come to bid you farewell. I didn't get very far in oh, that game. Oh, I know, I know. You think now to betray me. No, but you will never listen. I tell you, I will not forget our adage. 
fear. We are born oh. of the blood, made men by the blood, undone by the blood. Our eyes are yet to open. Fear the old blood. Farewell. I must take my leave. I don't remember any of these lines. He said the thing. Master William. By the gods, fear it, Lawrence. Or don't, whatever. Whatever's clever, bro. I'm gonna level up. Then Lawrence went to drink all of the blood. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> made little fishies by the blood. I forgot that part. I'm gonna sell some stuff. Doll clothes? Yeah. I have the stake driver. Oh, I'm on the, the buy screen, of course. Whatever. Sell it all. Some stupid grave. Damn it, doll. What? Yeah. Welcome home, good hunt. What is it you desire? What? I. I can't remember. Not a thing, only I feel. A yearning, something I never felt before. What's happening to me? Could this be... Tell me, Hunter. Could this be Joy? Ah. Joy boy. Could be. Welcome Probably not, with... though. Very well. Let... Mm, look at all that health. What a scrublet. Farewell. Could this be Joy? Could this be fantasy? Uh, do I have any baton? Yeah, 1.4%. Huge! It's tiny. <gasps> DLC, huh? Hmm. Yes, yes. All right. It is witches time. Witches time. You can fix her. You're a doll maker. Oh, that's very nice. Waiting for guiding moonlight. My guiding moonlight. Also waiting for guiding moonlight. Too bad she is inanimate. Not from what I can see. Only if you don't have eyes. Go. After playing a game so many times, there's like, there's not... You get into a habit of playing it a certain way, and you don't really, like, stop to look and appreciate. At least I do. <laughs> I am I am this way. You're just like, yeah, 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 run through forests, get item, fight boss, do good. This is how boss work, do good boss fight. So after coming back after a while, it's like, oh yeah, I forgot about this part and these things. And doors and dialogue. And things. Gotta take some ponderance time.
Yeah, for, for a time, certainly, when Bloodborne was at its peak, I, it was absolutely my favorite. And I remember saying that, but it was one that I didn't replay quite nearly as much. But, it just, it just is, it's so good. Ow, ow, ow. I was going somewhere else with that thought, and I lost it halfway through. <laughs> so now it made it sound bad, but I intended it to sound good. Gooder. Oh. Is good game, that's all. Have you ever beat Bloodborne game too hard? It's a tough game for sure. Especially the DLC. I also miss Sekiro, man. Sekiro is so good. Probably just because it's console only. If it was on PC, I would definitely play it more. I mean, yeah, and I, you know, without all the mods that usually come out for a PC FromSoft game. Yeah. Definitely a reason for me not playing it more. <sighs> ow, ow. Due to her corpse dog. Dude, Stellar Blade was is freaking sweet. That demo confirmed what I uh what I thought I was seeing in their gameplay demos, and that is that it is very fun and good. That comes out on the 26th. Which is actually when I return from St. Jude. I'm doing a trip out to St. Jude as we do pretty much every year. So I won't be starting it until the 27th, but I'm very excited to play that. Very good game. For the time being, the plan would be to do Try and finish Stellar Blade in time for May 1st, where I would like to start the Grimruck mod May 1st to kick things off. If it's ready, if it's ready, of course. I don't I don't know if uh what is timeline is for it, but that mod sounds insane, and I'm very excited to play it. Ow. A meet and greet at St. Jude? No. No, we always go to visit the campus. It's it's the hospitals. And um, in the past, we were able to, like, spend some time with the kids. But ever since COVID, they're very restrictive on that. But we learn about the new things that St. Jude is doing. You know, we get to see where all the money that we fundraise goes. Um, oh, I'm gonna be doing a, I think I'm gonna be doing a live stream from there. I think there's like some sort of competition to bake a cake. And I'll be on a team with Bloody, I think. So, I don't know what, I don't know what it's all about. I just said yes to a cake baking competition. I don't know, <laughs> we'll see how it goes. I've never b baked a cake, but I have baked bread, and that turned out very well. So that's probably the same thing, right? I've watched a lot of uh, British Bake Off, though. Strong bad voice. You said you'd bake us a cake. I don't. I don't get that reference. Checking the emails. Ah, Homestar. Do you remember accidentally shooting Garmin on first playthrough? Yes, absolutely. Yeah, and he just poofed into, into dust, and I was like, <gasps> yes. It's because the L2, the triggers on PlayStation controllers are so easy to accidentally hit. When you place controller down. Okay, it didn't happen now, but it just happens. You 
PC, we're playing the greatest game ever made today. Well, I'm not playing Dungeon Keeper today, but maybe, uh, maybe soon. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> I do love Dungeon Keeper, though. Ow. Wait. Blasphemy. Oh, boy. I'm gonna try and fight one of these axe boys. Hello. That always happens. Oh, but I didn't get the parry off. Hello. There we go. Damn! Alright. Let's try fighting one without parries. Hello. Stop this. Sunk it. Best game ever made is Sims 3, Change Your Mind. Interesting. It's true. I never have played uh, Dungeon Keeper 2. Ow. What? Headbutt. No, 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 no. Ah. Yeah. Ooh. Two K runes. Bloodborne bucks. Yeah. One, I hit one. No, I never think I don't think I've ever really looked up close. So they've got like insect mandibles, I see. Oh. I always thought they were like horns or whatever. I just assumed. They're either like mandibles or they're holding blades in their mouths? I don't know. Monsieur Doom! 14 months, welcome back. Yeah, like it looks like they're holding swords, but that... It just makes less sense to me. Even though... Having mandibles. Oh, I see. They got blades attached to their feet. So, yeah, they're like... Ooh, they're tied into their mouths. Okay. Well, that's rude. There are pencil sharpeners with legs. Delicious. They do have blades. Yeah. We did not finish Ronin yet, no. Ah. Oh, yeah! Double kill. Nice. On July 10th, you'll have been a follower for 10 years. 10 years. You think I'm gonna like no rests combat? Good. Because from what I've seen, I like everything else about it. Monster kill. 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 Screen flip on the Twitch app unfollowed you at one point. <laughs> what the... Yeah, I've been really liking Ronin. Eduardo FT Dubs. 105 months. Welcome back. Eagles. Oh, the best animal to strap blades to? Yeah. Ooh, an octopus? Ooh. Uh, 
I, I got upgrades. I got upgrade things. Very nice. No new gem slot. All right, one more level for that. Apparently you've only been following since 2017, but you were watching on YouTube in 2013. YouTube. Why your head is green and your beard is missing. Because life. I don't know. Zoro cosplay, I guess? Hmm. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Hold on, wait. Oh, whoops. That's a lot more. I thought they had two in the shop, but oh well. Short ritual chalice. I thought, oh, oh, that's the, that's the, R, the, yeah, the random one. Ah, man. Tuberu. Nice. Well, I killed her for no reason, sorry. Oh yeah, I kept forgetting that I left my phone somewhere and I'm hungry, hold on. Okay, probably got time for a quick chalice dungeon and then we're gonna watch the uh, <clears throat> the Warhorse Studios reveal, which people are assuming is Kingdom Come Deliverance 2. Uh, and then we'll come back to our Bloodborne playthrough. And I'm just gonna leave the YouTube stream all intact so we don't break it up like that. Um, Adventures of Henry take two, possibly? Hype? Gonna laugh so hard if it's something else? I I will if it's something else that's really silly. But if it's something else that's really cool, I will not laugh. I will be pleasantly surprised. Because then that would mean that we also have Kingdom Come Deliverance 2. As well as whatever they show to look forward to. Wow. If it's like Kingdom Come Deliverance the mobile game. Available now. Get your $9.99 starter pack. And 50% off your first gem purchases now. <laughs> then I will laugh. Angry Dad Thunderchild. Vicar Ammonia. Welcome back. Thanks for the resubs. Don't you guys have phones? Ow. That's... Uh-oh. I'm in... I'm oiled. Not anymore. Oh, Sons of the Forest enemies are here. Henry loves phone games. 
Henry. I'm really excited though. Isn't that, wasn't that uh, their first game? Kingdom Come Deliverance, that studio? Because I feel like especially if they've hit their stride with making content after that, like, and they, I, I feel like the polish will take a big step up, unless they try to add a lot more complexity, in which case it'll still be like a charming jank fest. It wasn't a jank fest, but it, you know, it, big open world games like that often uh, are tough to keep bug free. We'll say that, but I love it. I love it. Um, but they're check not Polish. Nice one. Oh yeah. I, ca I wanted to shoot you, not the other guy, Fulka. Sika Blia. Oi. Sulka. Yeah. They are checkmate. <laughs> Ooh, tempering blood gemstone. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. They should make it a survival craft game. I love me some survival craft, but... I mean, they should do what they want to do. That's, that's what I hope the most for, is that the developer is... Ow. Making game the way they want to make it, because that's when you get most love and attention put into it, I think. Oh, hello, Bagman. Oh. Bye. Go ahead. Uh. Don't get mad. Rats. Rats. Feels like I'm fighting phalanx and demon souls. Ow! Boo. Have I heard of the bag man in D&D 5e? No. Bag of holding man? Uh, the only thing I remember about Kingdom Come was spending 30 minutes in the woods trying to snipe rabbits and failing miserably. Oh, the hunt competition? I destroyed that chode. I don't even remember his name, but... Beat his ass. Unless you were just hunting in general in this case. Well, there's that. Hello, Wapsy. How's it going? I appreciate you watching for so long. And cheers to Italy. Is this the right way? How do I get back? Yeah. 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 Blood bows. Yep. Blood bows indeed. Ooh. Wait, what? Wait. Oh, wait. Oops. I thought this was the. Oh, there's another ladder up. That's what it is. It is not MGZ. Type in exclamation point favorites to find out my favorites. Mm. A Sekiro sequel would be very cool. I would love that. Sir Cosmia, 63 months. Hunter lifts with their legs, not their back. Good on them. Good on them. Giant. Oh, yeah. What a start. Ow. Oh, my God. The damage. Right. This is kind of... Uh... Oh. Ding, 
can parry this guy, right? Ow. Ow. Right? Oh, maybe not. Maybe not. Oh. Maybe not. Explosion. No. No scope, no scope, 360 no scope. Oh god! Well. He filled up my whole screen, so it was kind of hard to miss, I guess. Sweet. Nailed it. Nailed it. Bloodborne is number one for you combat wise. It's definitely got more to it. I think, well, I really should someday, like, go through Sekiro with the intent of, like, doing a very mm, complex build. Utilizing a bunch of prosthetics. Learning all the little tricks that you can do with those prosthetics. Like the Umbrella Shield, I'm always like, I'll never use the Umbrella Shield. But it, you can upgrade it and get some cool things it can do. Um, a mechanic playthrough. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. It's faster. Oh, I don't even have enough. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. Yeah, there we go. Oh, maybe. I need to do the DS1 video about all the cool paths you can take right at the start. So I've been thinking about doing what I mentioned before, which is taking a day off from live streaming to do just like a full focus playthrough of something like DS1 or games. That's one third, one third down. Where it's just me playing game. It's cool. It, it would take a day away from streaming, but it would be a more kind of... It would be a different kind of playthrough, you know? Sure, I'll take all these. Brother Shield trivializes the samurai guy who does the super fast double strike right below Genichiro. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. You spin the shield here. We were... Oh, we haven't done this fight yet. Okay. We'll pick back up here. For now, I think we'll swap, and we're going to watch the Warhorse reveal. I don't know how long it is. But I'll get some food ordered. We'll watch this Warhorse thing. It, it could be like five minutes. It could be like 30 minutes. I would expect like 15 minutes. I don't know. And then we'll come back to Bloodborne right after. Ah, they're in chat. We are almost here. Report. Okay. Oh, it might also, they might go live and then be like countdown time. Nine, 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 nine. I'm literally dying. Man, all right. War Horse, a 2011 movie by Steven Spielberg? I don't think this is that. Oh, you can't see right now. Sorry. There you go. Okay. Let me, uh, let me see what I'm doing for lunch here. Kingdom Come Requiem. <laughs> War S'mores? Delicious. Well, oh wait, premieres in eight minutes. Okay, yeah. I wonder if it's a... Uh, hmm. Yeah, we'll see. 
just a trailer or if they're going to do a whole thing, you know? Who is the publisher and who are the game devs? Uh, I don't know if they're self-published, but Kingdom Come Deliverance. Developer is Warhorse, right? Kingdom Come. Kingdom Come Deliverance. Why is Steam so slow lately? What's going on? Just Google the publisher. I saw there was a leaked trailer, so don't look it up if you don't want to be spoiled. <gasps> yeah, good call. Good call. Good call. Um, yeah. Oh, wait. They publish in tandem with Prime Matter, whoever that is. Steam, please. <laughs> there he is. A sword such as this will bring honor to its bearer. This is nice work. <laughs> It's new, isn't this it? This is the OG. You know the trouble not, with an it's not the new one. Life, son. It's not the it new one. Before it gets started, I might teach you how to handle a sword, and then someone will shoot you with a crossbow. Now, for the maiden bloodletting. Surely your father never would have imagined it would be your blood. Your blood. Such miserable luck to die by the sword you helped forge. Sometimes I ask myself what, what it all means. Why does God allow such things to happen? All this slaughter and revenge, over and over. Tell me, boy, who are you? What in hell's name happened? I've come from Scalitz. They burned it to the ground, slaughtered everyone. Who burned it to the ground? That's him. That's the bastard who led the attack at Scalitz and killed my parents. I'm sure we're all agreed that all this unrest must come to an end. I finally have the feeling we're doing something worthwhile. We're helping to save the king. Instead of saving his drunken majesty, I'd rather find that no, horse Henry, and my dude. parents. Get the sword back from him and skewer him with it. Uh, that's the actual fight where you spoiler him. Because I remember like two shot him and going, oh. That's it. It's because I did all the arena training for the, we have the combat's really cool, but war. yeah, you got to put in some time to learn it. I'm into, I, I'm super stoked for what they might do with combat. Um, Twenty eighteen, it came out. Wow, six years ago. Wow. With war hammers and shields! Didn't you insta kill that dude and then forget to loot him? Oh, I don't know. If I forgot, then I forgot. So <laughs> definitely don't remember now. Uh, okay. Jesus Christ be praised. Perfect. Four minutes. Four minutes. But that's not gameplay. Where's gameplay? Any game players? Does their does their Steam page actually show any in-game footage? I guess that's their first person. Them holding a weapon or anything, or I guess. Oh, there you go. Gameplay. Boom. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Those sounds. What's for lunch? I don't know. Um, let's see. I'm talking to Bloody about it right now. She went out to the dentist. Let me get some sort of, some sort of sandwich is what I'm feeling, though. 2018 was a peak year for gaming. Dude, last year was a peak year for gaming. This year is pretty dang good for gaming. Games coming out in 2024. Let's see. Hellblade 2, Stellar Blade. Destiny 2, Homeworld 3, Aiden, World of Goo 2. Uh, let's see here. We are in April. April. Uh, I mean, including games that came out already. Rise of the Ronin, Dragon's Dogma 2, Final Fantasy 7, Rebirth came out. Um, what else came out this year? Star Wars Dark Forces Remastered. <laughs> it's cool. Uh, 
Tomb Raider remasters. Mm. Uh, Balatro. PC Ghost of Tsushima. Let's see here. V Rising full release. There's Hellblade 2 during May. I haven't played Hellblade 1, so... I mean, that'd be down the line anyways. Shin Megami Tensei 5 Vengeance for, uh... JRPG enjoyers. Shadow of the Erd Tree, of course. Mmm... Mm. Oh, uh, oh, what's it called? This comes out. Frostpunk 2? Nice. Um, um, Black Myth Wukong comes out this year. <laughs> yeah, Wukong. Inotria was also, uh, like a Souls-like, right? Hello? Oh, uh, it froze. My Chrome froze. Um. <sighs> yeah. Which one was this? Gosh, it's like two minutes till... Okay, all right, whatever, calm down. TBA, so many games, I don't know. Yeah, we'll see. Stalker 2? Shit. They're going to launch on the same day as Elden Ring DLC. Which one? Wukong? Uh, what's up, Mauser? Firefox winning again. I'm going to go Opera. Gamer Opera mode. Whatever. We'll see. <laughs> oh, Inotria. Oh, yeah. I remember hearing that. From Soft should have let them have it. Summer Souls releasing on the Solstice. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Dawn Trail a week after Erd Tree. We might get a Witcher 4 announcement this year. I don't know anything about Witcher 3. Uh, oh. Story, so I don't know if that's... If they're gonna do a thing where they, like, reboot it or what, but... Mm. Alright. Looks like I'm on my own for lunch, so I'm gonna order, of course, Jersey Michaels. The standard Jersey Michaels. I'm ready. Come on, trailer. We're ready. We're ready, war horsers. Look, it's Todd. Oh. Kotek. Saberhagen. Welcome back. Boys, people, sins of a windmill. Thank y'all for the resubs. We'll be back to Bloodborne very soon, just after this reveal that we're watching here. Mersey Jikles. No, not that. Not that. Hmm. Two minutes, okay. Play! Play! I'm gonna pause it. No, never mind. This is bright. I'm gonna sneeze. Excuse me. Not even a 30 minute timer yet. <laughs> I'm glad it wasn't something super long, because sometimes that happens. I want to say Shadow of the Earth Tree did that. Perfect bio break. Yep, take him now. I played 50 hours of The Witcher 3. The last, like, 10 of which were Gwent, and then I stopped playing. One minute. The new YouTube premiere countdown, yeah, I guess. Oh, the colors. This is hype, the music. Some pretty sick half squares. Thirty seconds. Trippy waiting room, yeah. Drop your acid now. Six, five. 
five, four, three, two, one. Peggy 18. Mobile game? Henry? When it seems you're out of luck There's just one man who gives a fuck <laughs> All right <laughs> A friend will never leave you stuck. Now who can that friend be? Is it live action? Yeah, seems like it. Henry. Ah. A hero Henry. <laughs> it's been a while, but now we can finally show you Kingdom Come Deliverance 2. Surreal. It's like Max Payne. It's like the guy, the Max Payne guy. It's actual Henry. Oh. This is from the first game? When you're sieging towards the end? of leaving this place. Becoming more than a peasant. Dead. You know the trouble with an adventurous life? It can end before it gets started. His hair looks way better. Congratulations tonight. You finally become a man. Wake, Wake up. up. Pull yourself together, Henry. anything on a platter to men like you and me you still have a long way to go till your work is done dog pet dogs guns <laughs> oh henry oh merciful god be kind and protect us so we don't blow our arses off. Amen. Back to live action. Hello and welcome. Oh, shit. My name's Tom McKay. It's and a whole thing. With Dale, we're here to present the first in depth look at Kingdom Come Deliverance 2, an action <laughs> RPG set in a realistic world of the late Middle Ages. We're in Kuttenberg, a gorgeous city at the heart of Europe, but also at the heart of KCD2. So Henry let's exists. take you into Holy the world shit. of the game with the help of Warhorse, the creators of this medieval saga. It's almost exactly 10 years since I was doing a video like this, uh, introducing our new game. It's almost exactly six years since this game called Kingdom Come Deliverance was finally released. So now it's perfect opportunity to show you what we have been working on those six years which is Kingdom Come Deliverance 2. And where else to do it than in this magnificent cathedral in the royal city of Gutenberg, where majority of this game takes place. 
Shit. Now it's uh, 250 people working very hard for years him. to bring you the ultimate medieval RPG adventure. Ultimate? Kingdom Come Deliverance 2 follows the adventures of Henry, a young lad who barely survives the invasion of a raiding force on his village. Is it quadruple A? Henry though? embarks on a quest of revenge against those who butchered his family and burned his home to the ground. As a trusted squire and friend to young Sir Hans, our hero Henry is sent on a simple mission, but things turn ugly very soon. Oh, that's Kingdom the, Come Deliverance that's 2 right, that's is the a guy continuation you, of Henry's previous adventures. That's the guy that you but hunt the story's against, written in right? such a way yeah. that it's perfect for newcomers to Henry's journey. This dude. Henry is a character that I think everybody can identify with because he Hans, starts yeah. off that's as a kind of nobody and goes through life with all these immense challenges. And I, th I feel like everybody can relate to that. Hans is all the kind of fun times and all the kind of ebullience and joy that Henry has in himself, but it takes a bit of accessing, and I think Hans really helps him to do that. Whew. You were right about our stench. <laughs> Let's hope this water isn't too cold. Bathing! You wouldn't want your pride and joy shrinking. <laughs> I'm more worried about it being too deep. Too deep? Come on. What we are making now is what it was supposed to be in the beginning, but we were not able to do it because we didn't have enough resources and experience and all, all that stuff. We've proven that the concept works, and now we can take it to another level, which we always wanted. The game is much bigger in scope. Oh, shit. Original game, we had, I don't know, three hours of cutscenes. Now we have more than five. Okay. Regarding the size of the world, it's two times bigger than it was. Two times bigger. The story is longer and much more epic. So previously it was about an issue of small nobility with bandits in their villages. Now it's uh, about problems of kings. This is a behemoth of a game in comparison to the first, in my opinion. I think it's, I think it's got so much more energy and pace and adventure and action and fun. And, and trial and tribulation and just everything that you could want from setting up the characters so beautifully in the first game and then throwing them out there and going, right, let's see what you're made of. This is gonna be so much fun. The graphics don't seem Henry that much better, guy. but it could be so more optimized really like and also so deeply they just focus on making it bigger. In so. his already, you know, set character traits. But it looked nice already. So, so you can build your Henry in a different ways. And that all means that it's actually on you who you want to be. You can save the world, or you can help to punish it for its sins. Okay, so you was observed for 2018. Yeah, I just don't, I don't think they needed to update the engine. The combat is also historically accurate, but we don't want to do that for the historical reasons or something. We want to do that for the immersion. Nice. And we want you to feel salt in your hands. VR? We want you to feel threatened by the enemies on the battlefield. We want you to fight for your life. As far as uh, missile weapons go, we added new type of weapons. Oh, the we gun thing? Bows. Oh, no. Crossbows, yeah. Also, some early, early fire firearms. Yeah. Jesus. Kingdom Come feels like the good old school RPGs. Sometimes it though, will always surprise you what you can and cannot do. You can no, tell some of it is trailer combat. tailored. You can be a sweet so, talking guy who talks his way it out of problems. It could look better or worse. You, you can be a charming knight. You can be a thief. You know, a scoundrel. Anything you do will be recorded. People will remember it. If they saw you do that. Our crime system will react to that. Crime For example, system. when you are, I don't know, drunk and naked, people comment on that on the street. And now you can also reply. You can tell them, oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> or you can tell them, uh, piss off, man. If you do a lot of criminal stuff around the village, people will start to be suspicious. They will greet you differently. So try to make these little things. Nice collapse into like greater mosaic where <laughs> your actions are really reflected. That's what makes it, it the most fun, honestly. It always surprise you what can be done in Kingdom Come. Good. It's a perfect fuck around and find out game. Because well, boy did I fuck around different places, So one map is taking place on the actual place that's called Bohemian Paradise and it's really beautiful nature with 
quite unusual rocky formations all around. Mm. And then we are moving to totally different, rather urban countryside surrounding huge silver mining, very rich city. So there's this big city. The Kuttenberg is a huge step forward for us and it was, I would say, the biggest challenge in the game. Because uh, from those small outskirts and uh, small cities, you are really getting in the one of the richest cities in the medieval Europe. And it's really big. It's even too big, <laughs> in my opinion. <laughs> too big. We are trying to go beyond that usual uh, muddy, dirty medieval world, dark ages where everyone is dying uh, from famine or on war. It yeah. was really like colorful. Like uh, it wasn't dark at all. Well, we have really beautiful environments. Like players should go and explore it looks very all nice. those like little woods and beautiful rocks and castles. The thing that I love about the game most is just wandering around because the nature is really beautiful. It's it's really serene, peaceful. Ignore main and quest. It's full of secrets. Ooh. Nice. Oh yeah. A killer score. The music is big part of the I'm game. Here for it. Jan Valta is the composer as with the first game because I think he's also his genius. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the cathedral stuff is awesome. Tomorrow. Yeah, I'm, I'm wondering if they're going to state release date. I'm going to guess 2026. No, 2025. I'd say 2025. Today, releasing today. <laughs> That'd be pretty sick. The shadow drop. You'll be blown away. In this game, you can experience something you cannot experience anywhere else. I think players will be really impressed by that. <laughs> My message to the fans would be you are in for a ride. I love rides. Thank you for all your support. Please follow us on our journey to create something unique. Kingdom Come Deliverance 2 will oh, be released by the end of this, this year. This year! Holy See shit! You in KCDT. By the end of this year. Coming 2024. Holy poggers. Oh, 2024 looking, looking even more spicy. Good stuff. That was nice. That wasn't too long. It was a uh, yeah, little 15 minute thing all around good show good show <clears throat> good show yeah that music was awesome oh rainy day vibes well maybe a, maybe another day for now we're back to bloodborne this year's getting stacked er and stacked -er. the more we go Da, 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 da. All right, let's see here. Just closing some things. Okay.
More stacked than your pancakes? It's impressive. It's a lot of stacking. Okay. We were on our way to the witches. GG, thanks for watching that with me, guys. Thanks for your patience. If you're just like, I just want more blood barn. Oh, I gotta change the title again. You. Yeah. KCD2 2024. Nice. Saul Spearin. Da, 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 da. I almost put the game as uh, Kingdom Come Deliverance. <laughs> Wishful thinking, I guess. Good old messengers. Going for the second, second May. Oh, 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 can't wait for the second. May download the first one again, yeah. I never went to mod it, and I don't know how big the modding scene is for it. But there's definitely a lot of potential for some mod stuff. When will Sony put this on PC? Will it be this year? No. PS6. Wait for the PlayStation 6. What else would Bluepoint be working on? Legend of the Dragoon? Copium. Metal Gear Solid remake? Omega Copium. Bloodborne remake. Their own game? No? Sure, but the, I'm sure the studio has also grown with uh the, ow ah good gracious what a oh my god they're insane i've been willing to bet that they can be working on two projects at once over there they're working on ruining the art direction of beloved games no they're not because they're making their own thing and the they're not destroying the old thing that still exists Hate less, enjoy more. That's my motto. Unless they're witches, in which case, well, backstab spam. What a weird take, yeah. It's okay to not like a thing, too. Hello. Oh, don't die. Okay. Hello? Hello. Trying to have fun and enjoy life or something? Maybe. Nice. And then? much screaming. Wow, that's not where the lantern appears? That's weird. Best voice actor. <laughs> that person. Did a good job. They did a good job. Gently massaging that old lady's back. Yes. They got crusty skin. You gotta scrape off the dead skin cells. Serrated blade is perfect for that. Just perfect. What? Sorry, that was my Windows. Restart to install the latest Windows updates. <sighs> Maybe later. Zeppi, thanks for 38 months. Welcome back. Hello, good eye, honorable, and I will. You will hunt Twimble very well. Let me stay. There you go. No restart action on stream. Nope. Didn't end. Didn't end the YouTube stream. 
The YouTubers at this point have fast-forwarded if all, all they cared about was Bloodborne. Welcome back to those who have fast-forwarded. Can't wait until Steam Deck's OS is generalized for desktop computers? What do you mean by that? Uh, let's just repair. We have a better blood gym. Oh, we got way better blood gems. What the f Adept. Blunt. Oh. There you go. 9%. Huge. Do I have this on PS5 or PS4 Pro? Yes. I'm playing on PS5. But it doesn't adjust the performance at all, so. Um, that could be a fun stream. Lobos performs random Windows updates. Oh, there you go. HP regen on that, on that, uh, gun. Runs weird for you on PS5, but it could be your TV. Hmm, I don't know. I don't think I had noticed anything weird. Oh, wait, I can do runes now. But do we have any good ones? Can we get the one from... From your boy? What's his name? Jeffrey... Gary, Larry, you watch a whole stream of Lobo selling windows to shut up. Alfred, oh, um, I'm Gilbert. Gilbert, you must have had it. Well, I'm Gilbert. I remember it as soon as I heard that pathetic voice. I'm Gilbert. You know what big picture mode does on Steam? It basically allows you to just control Steam with a c controller. Like if you hook up your, you know, Steam to your TV, your PC to your TV, you can just use a controller and navigate your library and do all that stuff. Big picture mode. I don't know if it does more than that, but. Grand Cathedral. Yeah, Grand Cathedral. Your husband, Gilbert? Maybe. A-S-M-R-O-S -S Rage. <laughs> well, now you have to clock, Latreo. Latreo? You have to clock, because he said it. Um, you run big picture mode through your Steam Link device. Oh, to stream Steam to TV. Interesting. The last time I played this, I think, was last May for fundraising month. I mean, 2023 was an absurd year of games that I was just... I couldn't even... I still haven't caught up on all the games that came out in 2023. I've got Baldur's Gate playthrough going. Blasphemous 2, I only played one stream. Barely touched Starfield. Ah, uh, yeah, I just can't even begin to catch up to those games. So I'm kind of giving up. Surely he'll continue to do three. I would like to, yes. Very much so. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Starfield's a snoozer. I mean, I would definitely have fun with it. Uh... I know I played it and I was like I enjoy this regardless of where the story goes and whatever like maybe stuff would get uh, repetitive and this and that but especially with the mod scene like I know people will make mods that'll make it even more interesting Danny beats 109 months welcome back oh shit oh no we're good The pew pew is fun. You completed the tutorial and got bored. That's fair. You like what you like. No problems with that. I think I was, uh, eh. The only thing for me is RNG aim. And I'll always complain about that. And I kept looking for a mod that removes RNG aim. Maybe it exists now.
RNG aim is exactly what it sounds like. It's like there's a radius around your reticle, and when you shoot, the bullet will go somewhere in that radius, like that circular area, as opposed to where you click is where your your game goes. This one had no lock on target. Are you talking about Bloodborne? Yes, you can aim correctly and miss. Absolutely. You can be point blank on a dude, pretty much, and shoot, and it will just miss. But I mean, it's like, it's like, that's how like Fallout works as well. Uh, and other things. But, uh, yeah, I would just find it a lot more fun. Especially because I think I was playing on the hardest difficulty and enemies were kind of spongy, so I didn't mind. I wouldn't mind if I could just like headshot them constantly. Uh, creation kit and DLC will come out in the summer. Uh, Fallout 4 update next week? What? Yes, no spoilers, but. I've watched uh, two episodes of the Fallout show, and it's been very good. I've been enjoying it. We're doing, like, watch party with our friends, and there's going to be a series of weeks where we're out of town, so or all of us at various times, so we won't be able to continue watching it for about another week and a half or so. But we'll get back to it, and we'll watch it all. It's good. Uh, we just finished last night the Wano arc in one piece. We're done. Now there's only like... Ow. We've only got like... I don't know, like 18 episodes to catch up to one piece. We're finally, we're finally here. It's been a trip and now it's gonna... <laughs> oh, it's gonna be so long in between all the episodes compared to how we watched it. The binge is almost over. Spoiler war. War never changes. Sasenuka. 58 months. Welcome back. Hello. Oh. Fine. We actually caught up. It was a daunting, you know, 1100 episodes that we were like, we'll never do that. We'll never do that. But thanks to the power of one pace, we're here now. Oh. We did cheat, absolutely. However, Wano we watched all... Because they didn't have one pace push or something. <laughs> At a certain point they ran out, they didn't have all the one pace episodes, so we just started watching it normally. Oh boy. Ah, ah, you're gonna shoot me with a gun. There you go. You've watched the first 900 episodes like four times, yeah. Yeah, we're actually not caught up on Demon Slayer. Uh, we watched like the first couple episodes of the most recent season. But we've just been knee deep in one pa one piece. So we'll finally get to catch up on all the other animes we were watching. Oh. And then start other large anime series. Like Bleach or Naruto. Or something. I don't know. Wait. Bloody's bloody's all for doing the big series binges. Which is fine, and I love that too. I just, I like to watch all sorts of stuff. I like watching a bunch of smaller animes. Yeah, we watched Hunter x Hunter. Um, no, but I've heard a lot about it, Kraken. Can't commit to those shows. You can, you have the power, but I get it if you don't want to. <laughs> One Piece has been great. It's it might it might be my favorite anime now. Which for that was like my hero. My heroes had some pacing issues though. 
Let's go add some. Yeah, I don't know. The funniest anime anime for me so far. Funniest? I don't know, honestly. <laughs> well, One Punch Man's pretty great. Um, Chloe, thanks for two bucks. How you doing? Over on YouTube. Appreciate you. Oh, my sandwich is arriving right now. Do you ever watch Gintama? We started anime so late. Uh, I did. I have watched Konosuba, and I know the new season is out. I I've watched all of Konosuba when I had COVID last. But that was before season three, so. Ow. It's, uh. I mean, it's fine. I don't think it's one of the funniest anime I've watched. Uh. I liked One Punch Man a lot, though. One Piece Man. <laughs> uh, let me grab my sandwich. I'll be right back. There's a movie? Konosuba movie? Azumanga Daio is fantastic. Highly recommend. It's a very wholesome show about schoolgirls, but it's also very funny. And yeah, recommend. So many weebs and chat, yeah. It smells good in here, right? Legend of Galactic Heroes. You know, uh, we watched a, a, a fair amount of Cowboy Bebop and I just didn't vibe with it. Like I, I was, I enjoyed it while I was watching it, but after the fact, I never really wanted to like keep watching it. The music was good. Got it. I have to turn in my weed card. Heresy. Yeah. It was fine. Where's the where's the blood beast blood pellets? Oh, here they are. <laughs> he grabbed through the wall. Um I get my weeb card upgraded for that. Oh. Bebop is for sad boys? Sad boys. I, no, we haven't watched Samurai Shampoo. We started our anime journey so late. Um, Bloody and I. It was when Sekiro came out. Or right before Sekiro. Because they flew, they flew me out to Japan and I had a revelation. And I was like, ah, shit. All this weeb shit was right. They're all right. Uh... <laughs> I was converted. They inserted their weeb juice into my veins, and I was like, well... Actually, well, I was digging through old uh, my boxes of shit from, like, when we moved that's still in boxes in my closet. I found a really cool, it's still, like, mint condition, Sekiro Japanese, like, launch poster, and it's in this cool little, like, Sekiro holder that they gave me when I went there. It's really cool, it's really cool. So I put it in like, we've got like a little like, kind of trophy case full of like statues and various things. I did not watch Final Fantasy Unlimited anime, no. I didn't know that existed. Shaktea! 15 months, 
For the anime juice. For the anime juice. Patty Cakes also glad to see some Bloodborne. Haven't made it to a live stream in many months. Getting hyped for Shadows of the Erd Tree. Yes, Shadow of the Erd Tree. Yes. Oh, I did say it first. I wasn't, uh... I was not deflecting on the anime juice. Uh, oh. No. Snack. Yeah, here we go. Cabinet where I keep my what? Angry- Oh my god! Angry video game nerd awards. Oh. You ordered the helmet? I also ordered the helmet. I also have... I have an extra still packaged Millennia helmet that I've been saving and wondering about, like, doing a giveaway with it. Or is it, or it could be something that I want to save for decades to come too. Dibs, <laughs> time to wail. Yeah, let's see. Giveaway for charity, of course, because we are only like twelve days away now from the start of St. Jude month, twenty twenty-four. I got to get things rolling there. Amino, check that favorites command. It's been a year already, yes. It's also been a year since I got my sandwich, so I need to start eating it so I can live. Here, let me... I want to see this. Just really quickly, I want to go over that, that Grimrock mod again. Uh, where is it? Here, Elden Ring after the Shattering. <laughs> Oh, wait, that's right. It's being renamed because I think somebody also already named a mod that. But... Eh. Eh. Where's my mouse? Where's my mouse? There we go. There it is. Um, Grimrock's gone balls to the wall yet again. And created a new mod where the entire world updates at 5 a.m. every day. Dozens of enemy factions will roam and spread throughout the world. Form alliances, wage wars over territory and resources. Whatever the hell that means. Choose sides, attack strongholds, take commands of factions. Enemies, treasures, traps can spawn anywhere. Not just in familiar positions. Enemies anywhere. Rune bears anywhere. Dragons can swoop out of the sky at any time. Enemies hold grudges. They can steal items from you and show up somewhere else in the world. Endless new quests randomly appear anywhere. Monster hunts, dungeon time attacks, treasure hunts, timed belfry warp visitations, use equipment only dungeon challenges, boss rush gauntlets, and more. Major bosses are much, much harder. Like, this is so much for one mod. I have no idea what to even expect, but uh, that is... If it's ready, my intent is to play it May 1st. May 1st. So we'll see. Whenever it's ready is when we'll jump in and play it. <coughs> my fingies tingle with excitement for it. Ooh, a jalapeno. Oh. Number one. God damn it. Damn it, Bloodborne. What is keyboard and rat? Oh, like keyboard and mouse, but rat. I got you. Keyboard and rat is for dungeon, uh, darkest, uh, uh, dark and darker players that hide in corners. WTF is KCD2, Kingdom Come Deliverance 2. Mm, I mean, I, I think Wano is my favorite One Piece art so far. It's been superb. The art, the step up in the art is just absurd. We watch, well, we watch all of our anime subbed, if possible. There's even anime that we haven't watched because it didn't have a Japanese uh, dub. 
<coughs> uh, Avatar The Last Airbender. But, the only things we've watched with English dub is Dragon Ball. And I think that's it. Just Dragon Ball. So we have not gotten into any mecha, if that's what you mean by super robot genre. I'm not sure if that is what you mean. We watched Steins Gate, yes. We really liked it. We didn't watch any spin-offs. Is, is zero, zero a spin-off? I think Zero is a spin -off. Uh, I can't remember. Avatar Last Bender, Airbender is American slash Nickelodeon show. It is. It is. And so that's why it's English. A different time loop. But I'm... Okay. But the but the show, I don't know. I, I would just consider that like a a, bra a branch off from the OG show, unless it's more about the same people. It's a prequel. Gotcha. We watched the first. I don't know how many episodes of Ow, good God, of Doctor Stone, but we fell off it pretty quickly. Has it been pretty good? Oops. Is it is it ultra poggers? I'm gonna take a bite of the sandwich already. Hmm. Hmm. Delicious and Dungeon I've wanted to watch a lot. Gundam Iron-Blooded Orphans. Damn. Sounds intense. I, um, I don't remember the names of any characters from Steins Gate. We, we watched it, like, probably five years ago at this point. Mmm! Yes, Mob Psycho we loved. We haven't watched the new season, though. But that's going to be coming up pretty quick on our watch list. You. Quit your moaning. Ah. Pig. Blackwood, thanks for two months. Welcome back. Hold on, what have I done? I ruined my dashboards. There we go. You read all of Dragon Ball, nice. The only manga I have read is, um, I got bloody a gift of the first, well, what, the first box set of the One Piece manga, and so I read that a little bit. Oh, and I also, at some point, read some Berserk in digital format, though. JoJo is fantastic. We are... We watched, like, the first... Oh, God, I forgot about this. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Uh, what do I do? Hold on. Shit. We watched the first part of the most recent season. And we watched all the rest of JoJo as well. Ow. Uh oh. Nice. Ah, oh, shit, I'm dead. <laughs>
Oh, whoops. I forgot I have the shortcut. Um, if, I, if I could re-experience any game, I'm um, probably Bloodborne. Yeah. It's a trip first time. Good shit. Best anime, non-violent anime you guys have ever seen. Hmm. Food Wars. <laughs> Food Wars is the first anime we ever watched. But we haven't finished it. My family is great. We haven't watched season two, Blowing up people's clothes. That's true. Corey in the house. That's, yeah, that's a good one. <clears throat> Tokyo Ghoul is interesting. I think I liked it. I think I liked it. Oh boy. Uh, let's see. How do I? Hmm. Is he hand? Is the hand he holds out to the doll the same he sticks in the pigs? Probably. Oh yeah, chainsaw man. One more chainsaw man. Yeah. do a Lobo's Junior Meetup, please wash your hands after pig fisting. Me? No promises, but people will come in. Yes, please. Am I a little rusty? I mean, I guess. I haven't played it in a year. Sure. I mean, that boss is also just very easy to get. Completely clusterfucked by him. I understand if I look bad because people are used to watching like zero hit runs and shit now, but that's just not, that's not me. I take hits all over the place, I die. That's okay. You're rusty to me, buddy. If by give up on Final Fantasy XIV, you just mean unsubscribe, like, yes, I did unsubscribe from the game. But I do intend to come back. In fact, somebody... Oh. Bloody was, um... I think resubscribing and so if she does then I'll come back what do you mean you're not paying this up while not playing only blizzard do I for some reason leave that sub there in case I need to hop on and give the guild leader to somebody else nope I got through to the first dungeon of endwalker that's as far as I got I did it with Jergy, and then I stopped playing. Hmm. I wonder if those things are related.
Bloodburn doesn't have enough poison swamp. Hey, I healed you perfectly fine, so we're pulling that entire dungeon. <clears throat> You're not wrong. Did I get bored of FF14? It's just MMOs take a lot, right? MMOs take a lot. I already have two ga two daily games I play now. One, Nikkei. Nikkei I play every day. And now we started up Monster Hunter Now because we wanted to start walking a lot more. And Pokemon Go was great, but they nerfed um, raid tickets. And that was... We didn't like that, so we stopped playing Pokemon Go. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. Is now any good? Oh, we've been enjoying it. I don't know what good is to you. I've been having fun with it. It's a number go up game. Ah. What is now's gameplay loop? I'll have to get much farther and then I'll let you know. Oh god. Oh god. Please die, please die, please die. I think he's dead. Okay, nice. Now. Ah. ah, this is scary. Hold on. There we go. No. No, 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 no. Ow, fuck. Okay, nice. No! Ow. Ball bag. Do not summon snack! This is fine. Now that's what I like to see. Yeah, there you go. Alright, here we go. This guy's Tenetris doesn't even spark. Well, he doesn't use the L2. What can you say? Too easy for me. Yeah, sure, after dying twice. Just getting the first first guy down. Ooh. The Salwin and the Spearin. It's going pretty good. Oh, uh, nice. Oh. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. All right. Uh. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, I feel that, Osbin. That's why. That's actually why I started doing challenge runs is like when you first fight a boss it's like damn this is tough but you're enjoying it and then you master the boss and you're like well now the boss dies too slowly or too quickly so i don't get to enjoy it so then comes the challenge runs that's why i started doing them welcome it's like oh i get to Very fight well. the bosses that i enjoy Let the echoes become your strength for longer longer periods of time Let um, skill. Yeah, you do it SL1. But, I mean, not always SL1, because SL1 is like you get one shot, and that's not always the most fun. So when I started out, I was doing like, okay, let's do fist, fist weapon only, or shield only, or things like that. Lower damage, but not just like... Gruelingly slow. Just so much that you get to enjoy it. Mm -hmm. 
all your runs are challenge runs because you're bad? Nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with being bad. Or for... Dying a bunch, or this and that, or being rusty. It's fine, it's fine. Ah, oh my god. I think I'm dead, unless I do this. <laughs> Alright, well... <clears throat> Being bad equals more enjoyment for a win. You're not wrong. Probably. Mm -hmm. Aha! I have the upper hand now, fool. Oh. That's what you get for not being observant. Ah, uh, you die a lot to not to not make chat feel bad. Now that's that's a good strat. Wait a minute. Did I spend my souls? I think I did. Yeah, I did, okay. And I got them back from that. Okay, okay. It's almost rom-com time. Oh, I fell on him. Let me eat a little bit more sandwich. It's getting soggy. My fan of BLT sandwiches. Sure. I'll never order one, though. I need more meat to everything else ratio. BLT bacon, lettuce, tomato. I also uh, started realizing that I think bacon is pretty mid, actually. Yeah. Ah, oh, 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 oh. Worst take ever. But where are you going to take it? Where are you taking that take? Half of chat is rioting, half is agreeing. Yeah. What the fuck? No, for me, bacon's just like too greasy and small. I much prefer breakfast sausage. I'm too greasy? Am I? What's my grease level? Get some big dry bacon. A curious proposition. Bacon also tends to be horribly cooked in your experience, at least in restaurant. Yeah, like the only bacon that I'll like really like is like a nice, fresh, crispy, like hot off the stove bacon. I'm not talking about restaurant bacon. I'm just talking about bacon in general. A well-cooked bacon 
when it's fresh. It's great, but it's not that great. How crisp, though. I, I, oh, oh, Jesus, the damage. I'll fuck with various levelings of crisp, for sure. Oh, uh, ay, yeah, yeah. Don't do it, don't do it. Don't do it, don't do it. It should stay rigid. Um, I, I like some crisp, but not too much crisp, because then it all falls apart, and then too crisp. I'm talking U.S. bacon. You want floppy bacon? Yeah, then it's just bacon bits. Black bacon bits. <laughs> Maximum crisp only. Oh. Don't. Is that not a parry? Like, I'm okay with taking the hit, but like, the timing of that. I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck, I'm stuck. Nice. Mm. What? Can you not parry this son of a shit? Okay, that's it. No. You follow up. Okay, you don't follow up. You never follow up. You don't know how to follow up. You wouldn't know a follow up if you followed up the side of a barn. Ass. Just die. Stupid choir guard wearing shit sack. All right. <clears throat> when I think mid, I think mid tier. Like something's bottom tier, mid tier, or top tier. That's a very decent GPU to buy Rune Kitty. So I'm saying bacon is mid tier. Which is that it's not great, but it's good. But it's not bad. If mid meant top, how would you think of it then? I I don't think of anything anymore. My brain broke. Chat's Spallus. Your weird man, dude. Spallus is called chat mid. Oof. Oof. But thanks for the bits, Spallus. Also, Zalek, thank you for 11 months. Muzlika Crew and Yautzen GS. Welcome back. Hmm. Well, I'm probably going to have to do this a slow way. Slow and safe. Spewers, spewers. Hell divers too. <laughs> Already pushed it to third phase? Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. That's not good. Oh, 
stupid. Stop spamming! Stop! You spa it's spamming! It was spamming so much! Are you fucking... Holy shit. I don't remember that happening. Marzipan, 500 bits. Suck my ass, Spallus. Oh my god. Sixteen gigabytes of VRAM. Holy shit. Back in my day, video cards didn't didn't even have sixteen megabytes of video RAM. The Recta Voodoo two eight megabit. Megabyte. Yeah, there's a fastest thing between here and Oakley homie. Um Do I like rooster jokes? Cock. Sorry, what? Yes? I don't know. Yeah, four megabytes of video RAM. It's crazy. Crazy. <laughs> Uh, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, this is a very high beast beast hood set. Bring up. Oh, wasn't wearing the pants. Oh, cause I bought them and didn't. Yeah. I'm bringing my beastly hood. Zoids, no. Anybody remember zip drives? Me neither. I don't remember them. I think you made them up. See how this do. Oh God! Fuck! I fucked that up like a mother. Holy shit! Oh, that was so wrong. Incorrect. What? My strats. Baby time. 
Phew. Perfect cutscene to finish my sandwich with. I always like how it looked like the hunter gets crushed by the moon. I was so confused when this happened the other day during the eclipse, but then I remembered Bloodborne. Okay, sandwich complete, ritual secret broken. Hey Lois, how would you describe Bloodborne lore in one word? For me, it's cock. Uh, for me, it's um, menstruation. Jub, 60 months, welcome back. Yum, don't look up. Nailed it. Whoa. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I really shouldn't have. It's a lot of delicious saturated fat in there and calories. It's okay, I'll burn them off fighting Bloodborne bosses, right? <clears throat> I'll burn them off playing Monster Hunter now later. We finally start getting some chunks for this saw spear. Let's press the buttons really hard. That sounds expensive. Monster Hunter now later, yeah. That's what I said. You heard me, didn't you? Yeah, your ears work. Tube. Isn't that what they call you in, uh, Cyberpunk? Chub? Chu? Chode? Ch chub? Something like that. Chum! That's what it was. <laughs> Jersey Mike's got a good brownie. Whoever their brownie chef is, they're top tier. It's a good brownie. That's preem chum. Oh boy. I do not roll mid-roll ads at all. Because I hate money. <clears throat> Ew, money. Oh. I only want as much money as I need to survive. Ow. All right, I haven't opened this yet. And I've been doing a very good job of <laughs> not having extra money. <laughs> so, good shit. Have you determined the money split for St. Jude Month this year? I do not have, especially, we're gonna see. Um, I turned on my tax stuff and they filed an extension for me and I still haven't gotten the numbers back But I will likely not have we'll basically probably do it like a, a final subathon day again So no sub split or anything throughout the month because I just can't afford it 
unfortunately. I got a beard, a beard cut. I cut my beard. Ow. What's up, Dryad? The hair was green once, that's true. Yeah, no, I just got I want people to know. For sure. Ah, 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 ah. That I will not be able to help contribute. Um, oh, wait. So. There is going to be a... Uh, I think we are going to have a shirt design in time. It was kind of close, but I think we're going to have our shirt design. And... I will, at the end of the month, once we see all the shirt, uh, stuff, give, uh, the proceeds for the shirt sales. I don't think, I don't think they'll be able to automatically do that for me. That would be nice. Well, I'll have to look at it. I haven't set up the shirt yet, so. But the proceeds of, for that will go towards our St. Jude campaign. It won't, they won't land during the month unless I set a cutoff date or something. Oh, uh, we did some brainstorming for, oh wait, for goals, uh, incentives and stuff. So we're going to do St. Jude month differently this year. Previously, it was like we would have to do overall, you know, fundraised money. And then we would hit goals that way. And then I was things would be unlocked but I don't know why I've always done it that way it makes much more sense and is much more fun IMO uh, easier to design as well if we just create a bunch of incentives that people can donate toward and once those goals are met the things happen because that way people can put their money towards whatever they want to actually see while contributing to charity of course instead of like and I don't have to worry so much about, like, oh, is this a higher tier goal? Will people even like this? Hey, if they don't like it, they won't donate towards it. So, like AGDQ kind of incentives. So, that's what we're going to do. Yes, it is five tone. Yeah, I've talked about it a couple times already today. Gone through that Grimruck mod tweet. Unintended. Chunks. Chunks. <laughs> Get better bonus from tier three sub. Do you mean percentage wise? Uh. I think it's still the same split regardless of sub. Uh, tier. Which is seventy percent. Follower only mode off or something. I'm not sure. Oh, viewers bonus? Mm, you get tier two and tier three sub emotes if you subscribe at tier three. I don't, I haven't, oh God. I haven't really, I don't even think most of those emote slots are filled, but there's a couple like basically just Lobos gold blank. There are, Dino, yeah. The Golden Mind Blank. Followers only is off. Oh, God, hold on. I, um, where do I go? Wait. Oh, I think, is there a, hmm. Well, going this way. I think this is where I go. There's a bug over here. Want a scurrying beast. Wandering madness, whatever you call him. Isn't it? But I, I think I ran past it. Oh, oh god. Um, oh no. Oh no. Oh dear. Okay, I'll just go in here. Wandering Nightmare? There were like seven names for those things. I... Now nah, I just call them Crystal Lizards. They're Crystal Lizards. No! Also, no! Do not cannon me. Oh, I didn't see that guy. Well, it was too late. 
Oh God, I'm playing on a PS5. Wandering Madness is made up by Fextra. Wait, what? But they said Wandering Nightmare. Somebody else said Wandering Nightmare. And I've also heard Scurrying Beast. I, I don't know. What's up, Iron Maiden? How's it going? Oh. Dogs. Goodbye, dog. Bye. Fish. Fish. Yes, as you want. Uh, I think Twitch started to crack down on the embedding of, of streams like Fextra was doing. Um... Okay, if you stream nothing but stream elements talking. <laughs> stream elements. Hey, stream elements is they they're great chatters. They keep the engagement up, you know. Oh, they don't stream anymore? Yeah. Yeah. Well. It would make it pretty obvious if they kept streaming and then they had like 13 viewers or something. Uh -oh. Oh. Yeah, Marcy Pin. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I wonder if you if I wonder if they were getting like full on ad rev for doing that. Or if the Twitch viewer has to be on site. I would think on site, because otherwise, like, holy shit. <laughs> uh oh. Give me your butt. I want your butt. There you go. No, your butt, not your face. Wait, maybe he has a face on his butt. They were getting sponsored based on their viewership. Ooh. You want to not be bothered by you not picking up the key to the upper cathedral, but you are. Ah, oh, shit. I dropped down there and then I just went and dropped off the other side. I'm bothered by that. Oh, I'm really bothered by that. Thank you for telling me I'm leaving. I'm bothered, yeah. Mm-hmm. Mmm. Brownie. Thank you for again for the two bucks, Chloe. Sorry. Mmm. Cheers, Tankred. Have a good one. Uh, I went the wrong. This is not where I wanted to be. Well, it's too late now. <laughs> Uh, it's not too late. You didn't even notice? Yeah. I was just chatting and... I guess not autopiloting, because I would have gone the right way if I autopiloted. Boy, I can't wait for PS6, so our, the remake will... either make the loading insane, or they'll make it so you don't have to... You can warp from a... a, a, a lantern. I mean, Blue Point did that for uh, for Demon Souls, right? I don't think you could warp from uh, Nexus things, Nexus stones, or whatever. Sawspear is extremely viable. Pretty much every weapon is viable. The ones that I would say are not, which they are, they just they're not gonna treat you well. Torches, Fist of Gratia. 
amygdalin arm. <laughs> now there's something else that's also not great, right? Well, the shields. Yeah, you can't attack with shields, so. Hydrakami has uh, redeemed a fun, interesting fact. That ultimate mod for Bloodborne you saw quickly added teleport from lamps. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Let's see here. Oh. Hmm. Oh, facts about cats. Here we go. Pat. Oh, my gosh. Cats. Cats purr at frequencies that can help heal their bodies and improve their bone density. I didn't know that. That's crazy. Is Chloe here? Six months. Welcome back. You're here. D Diddles, 32 months as well. Welcome back. Cats are Wolverine. Yeah. <laughs> That's nuts. Cats are nuts. Catnuts.com. No. No. Stop. Uh, let's see here. Blood Rapture. I'm going to go get... I'm going to go kill Gilbert now. Orange cats are super dense. I will, I definitely will, Vargas. I'm not sure if it's going to be, like, immediately. Like, I could play it tomorrow. I could play it tomorrow. It's been, it's been quite a full schedule as of late, but I, I, that game very much caught my interest. Got my attention. Blackos there. Sorry, not sorry. Is it is the scaling still equal? Ah, oh, there we go. Now it's C scaling in Dex. Okay, or er, skill. Excuse me. Um, Bergenworth. Bergenworth. Blasphemous. Bergenworth. Blood Christ, fiends. I remind you of your elementary school teacher. Well, tell them I said hi. How is elementary school going for you? Your dog got beat up by an orange cat the other day. Cats fuck, dude. Wait, no, no, I need, I need to go get the key. God damn it. Well, I wasn't lying. Orange cats are crazy, man. They're pretty crazy. Hammer. Oh boy. Good old. Trusty old Kirk Hammer. Hey, what's up, Mr. Bungus? Oh. Um, oh, so I I don't take off the vinegar on the number 13. I only take off the oil. And no, I do not add more oil. Um, oh. It was much closer to go from the other lantern. Oh well. I'm, oh, I see where I am. I keep focusing on other conversations and then I get lost kind of. There we go, I did it. I'm not even gonna open the door. Ah! Oh shit, I didn't realize, I thought you were immune sooner than there's a chair there. <laughs> With extra onion. No. 
a true Texan drinks oil. Not that kind of oil. The other kind of oil. Oh, wait, um... Okay. Now we can take elevator. Standard seating fixture, 2 OP. Oh. Mm hmm I talk about Jersey Mike's so much, you're going to order some. Jersey Mike's owes me big, dude. They owe me. The amount of influence I've in I've influenced. They owe me. Um Let's see how this goes. What the sound Here we go. It begins. It begins. Don't do that, sir. It begins and continues. Oh, is that not right? Guys, I thought from software games were hard. No frame drop! That's how you know it's a PS5 version. That's how you know. Hold on, this is just the Tower Knights Arena. Shh! Shh! They'll, they'll hear you. They'll hear you. Dum, dum, da, da, dum. No beard right now, JG. <clears throat> I'm just refreshing my roots. Hmm. Oh, I didn't put in the claw mark room. Oh, I didn't get the claw mark room. Well, hi. Sorry, bye. <laughs> Hello, Nye. How are you doing? What's up, smooth face? Smooth skin. Blug board. Demon souls sequel confirm. Umbasa be praised. Blug board. Blug. This is the best game ever, but Elden Ring is just a little bester. <laughs> There's definitely more content. Right. Gilbert. My name's Gilbert. Realizing Lobos has no glasses. Unless I do. I have glasses. Hiya! Gilbert! Thank you. Who are you? You haven't been stuck listening to Glorb? You mean Glorp? Who's 
glasses are those? There's no glorp on YouTube, is there? Unless there is. What glasses are that? My. That are my glass. You've been pondering your orb for how long? Oh, rich. Well, I, uh, sure is. Fortify the pistol. I look like a sexy librarian. Do I? That's what I look like to you? When's the last time you got your eyes checked? My glasses suit me. Well, these aren't my glasses. These are actually sunglasses that I popped the lenses out of. I never wore round frames. I was always the rectangular frames. More like this. Closer to this, anyways. These are eclipse glasses. I can't see anything with them. Um, eclipse glasses run when. I understand. They're pretty reflective, though, huh? Maybe. Maybe I could pop the lenses out of these real quick. Oh! That was easy. There you go. They're so wide. They're so wide. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. All right. Almost time to wake up. I look like I'm from the future. Oh, what is, before I pop the lenses out. I look like the CEO of a tech company. Can I go to a bank and tell them to give me a billion dollars? Since I own a company. Hey, Poindexter, computer club's that way. <laughs> Jesus. Was it the 90s? Oh, are you guys ready? For the uncharitably done? Here you go. Deep lore. <laughs> One sec. Deep. Oh. No matter. Such. There we go. Ready for deep lore? Oh, doubt me not, sweet compere. <sighs> that was uncharitably done. done. That was uncharitably done, done, dear friend. friend. <laughs> it's so funny how it sticks out because I've heard it so many times, but the lines around it do not. It's just like, oh yeah, it's an NPC dialogue, NPC dialogue. What is... This sound is so familiar. It sounds like it's pasted in, yeah, right? Oh, Bloodborne put my charity alert in the game as a sign of respect to our... Patches the Spider cosplay this year. Green bodysuit, spider body PNG. Oh, that actually, uh... That's much, uh... Much more reasonable than I was thinking. <clears throat> Last line's way louder, yeah. You need the, what, the children cheering alert for St. Jude's month last year? Oh my gosh. I feel like I need to do... I need to look like Powder. Wait, does anybody remember the movie Powder? Because I brought that up amongst my friend group. Who are around my same age. And nobody knew about the movie Powder. But... Basically... Set my face up like Powder. And fucking, the bald guy with powers, yes. The, he's like a, a very... Super pale, pure white. And you can like channel lightning and shit. That movie didn't exist. Didn't he explode in the sun? Shit, I don't know. I don't remember. Get out of here. Hmm. 
Hmm. Death by crit. Worms just sit. Death by swing. Worms do their thing. That's a rhyme to remember. If you kill those guys with a crit or fire, worm killed by fire, worms no higher. More mnemonics. <laughs> pointless. It's pointless things to help you remember. You can tell it's a rhyme by the way it is. That's right. You're a wise one. Um. He, like, turns into electricity? Does he? Lore accurate whiteness. Yes, he exploded in the sun. Shit. I always get them to be frenzied. Instead of me. First. And then we run. Uh, I didn't look up at the... I want to look up at it. Oh, God! The light coming from there is so cool. The beams, the rays. Uh-oh. It's just like the tower in Elden Ring? Ah, yeah, if you're not familiar. Bloodborne did it first, baby. But yes. It's quite cool. It's cool to stand on that bridge and explode blood spines everywhere. Oh yeah, Bubble Boy. No, I never saw Bubble Boy. Can't believe they copied Elden Ring. Believe it. A lot of people copied Elden Ring. I'm looking at you, Skyrim. Is that what it's called? Or is it Sky Skyrim? I don't remember. Too new to remember. Mm. I'm not killing this guy. Swoop. Skycraft? Oh, okay. Todrum. Uh oh. <clears throat> Would it be difficult for Shadows of the Earth Tree to beat Ring City? You mean in terms of DLC greatness? Well, the, uh,. The peak of FromSoft DLC, for now, is Old Hunters. For me. Um, and it would be very impressive for it to top that. But I believe in From. I believe in them. I believe in from soft. I believe in Lara Croft. Oh god. If from soft made Tomb Raider. Oh, that would actually be kind of cool. But it's probably just Chalice Dungeons. Ow! Skyrim sat on your shelf for like three years before we played it because you just couldn't get into the combat at first. Yeah, and then you realize that Skyrim isn't really about combat. At least the things you enjoy in it. Kind of. Or, or you get like a million combat overhauls and Dark Souls rolling and shit for Skyrim. It's about cheese wheels, absolutely, and putting pots on top of NPCs' heads, and killing chickens, and enraging an entire populace. Oh. And Fusro dying graybeards off of cliffs. Good shit. What's up, Rock Rock? What can I say? I blast. Or something. It's about yelling at dragons. You are right. You got videos where a guy... Wait. 
Where's the cutscene? There it is. Performs a census on every town in Skyrim to see what the Some average rate of unemployment is. <laughs> Do you hear the our prayers? No. We shall not abandon the dream. No one can catch us. No one can stop us now. I don't know why, but I see his face. <laughs> And I think about the old McDonald's mascot, Mac Tonight, but without sunglasses. I don't know what. It's so random, but that's what I see. It's Mac Tonight. Oh my god, he gave me God RNG. What a G. Yes, the Moon Man. That's Mac Tonight. Hmm. No, no, no. No. Don't fall asleep. Oh, I think he fell asleep. Oh, no, he didn't. No. Oh god! Oh god! Oh no 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 no! Holy shit! They fixed them, huh? Oh my god. Oh god. Oh god. He's fighting outside of his thing! And there's too many of these idiots around. Oh god! Oh shit! It's... Don't. I don't think I've ever fought him outside of his room like this. Maybe I have. Not this far out, though, I feel like. Yeah, he used to, uh... also fixed them like you used to be able to cheese them with poison arrows from above but then like they teleport them somewhere or something I don't remember 
best game. Well, not because of that guy, that's for sure. Hmm. <laughs> the Simon's Bowblade G's. Well, yeah, if you go to the DLC before this, or it's New Game Plus or something, yeah, for sure. Hmm. Poison knives make him breaking it stuck. But they changed it at some point. Oh, wait, the poison knives still work? Yeah, I remember you would hit him and he would, like, disappear in fog, but then, like, reappear right here again. And you could just keep hitting him. I don't know, it's weird. Anyways. Yeah, I'm playing on PS5. The only performance difference, to my knowledge, is, like, the couple of places in the game where I would see frame drops. There are not frame drops anymore. But it doesn't go past 30 FPS or anything, for sure. It's locked. You hit him in a specific spot right after he jumps down and it works. Nice. Good enough reason to restart the game over to test this. I get him. What's up, Ryan Price Lifts? How are you? From the UK. Ah. I've never, never been to the UK proper. I've been through Heathrow, that's it. That's it. Hmm. The U United King Kong? Use my words. They must feel right at home then here in London, yes. I made a joke about all the horrible beasts writhing in poison alleys being some sort of British hangover festival. So you're... Uh... Oh, wait, did I get it? I'll get it. Oh, did it. Not yet, not yet. Now is the time to get the better gems. Unless you fancy being wet and cold, don't come here. Well, I mean, I figure I know what it's like. We usually go LARP for five days in, especially last year was cold and rainy and I spoke in a British accent and I wore a cloak. So I'd probably just do that in England, and then fit right in, right? What about wet and hot? Uh, do the accent now. Um. Uh. Shit. My mind's blinking. I was going to do something overblown, but I forgot. Can't just ask to do the accent now. I'll get canceled. Yeah, mind blanking. Any chances some chalices? Oh yeah, I did one chalice. I'm down to do more. Down to do more. We've got, uh, of course, DLC to do as well. I was kind of, I was kind of uh, barreling towards DLC because that's arguably some of the best fights in the game, or not arguably, just definitively the best nights in the game. But I suppose I would be a bit overpowered for some of the early chalices, but who cares? I must don the cap to speak the accent. Yeah. Do you mean this cap? And this accent? Yeah, you're talking about this accent with this cap, right? This cap right here. Yeah. There you go. Fits over my... Fits over my head headphones. Perfectly. Perfectly. Hell yeah. What's up, Uncle? Yeah. Boy, I tell you what. Oh, shit. Uh, oh, no. I forgot. Hold on. I frame the frenzy, baby. 
Now y'all need some burger and pistol. Burger? Burger. I want some ribs. This is a Squid Billy's reference. I don't know. Actually. Ah, oh, yeah, the rest of the cap gets green screen too. Oh shit, it's not dead. No, it's dead. I'm gonna blow. No, no, no. Ah, 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 ah. <clears throat> yep, you I frame the damage from a status effect. Yep. You can do that with doors as well. Uh, yeah. Legal. Yeah, I mean, pairing them is really risky, because if you miss it, that happens. Uh, fuck a duck bag. I'm going to explode as soon as I load in. That's what she said. What does the hat say? Women fear me. Fish fear me. Men turn their eyes away from me. As I walk, no beasts dare make a sound in my presence. I am alone on this barren earth. Fish picture. Fish pic. Sigma mindset. I don't know how to... This kind of works. I'm gonna blow. Here I go. I framed. <laughs> so remember, remember that next time somebody's pissing you off, just I frame it. Oh, oh, shit! I blew anyways. Um, me fear me. Yes. Yeah, temporary damp blood damp five. Yeah, Ken Cold. Where's Ken Coldblood? Parry them with a gun. Oh, well. Hmm. Uh, ah. What the? Oh, okay, it's just rocks. Gun parry op. The hat's so tiny. I know. Right? You've only recently started to pick up that tempered blood gem. That is like one of the easiest, quick grab, best gems. Unless you're, if you're doing a slow playthrough, then you, uh, and you go to DLC, you'll have plenty of good gems. But that was like a speedrun gem. That one and the two 15 percenters. Oh, wait. Is it two 18s and a 15? A 15 attack gem and two 18 fizz gems. Scream! Hello, Mornov. Oh! My- Yeah. Brain of Mensis is so cute. So cute. The choir bell's over there. I never get it. But I like it. Schwum. Schwing. Schwum. Schwep. Sleepa. Also a very good arcane gem right there. Arcane damp blood gem. Mo looking. Oh wait, maybe that's the good blood. Oh, that's blood tinge gem. Yeah, not arcane. When you play through Bloodborne, now you do chalice dungeons as you get the relevant challenges until the story to progress and you return to main game. Yeah, that's how it's meant to be done. That's what Miyazaki-san himself intended. Uh, perfect. Ring the demon bell, coward. Wow. Wrong game. Oh, choir bell, demon bell. Yes. Let, oh. I didn't get the other gym yet. And uh, upgrade materials. I didn't get either. Crap. Well, I'll be right back again. Thanks, Loud Waffle. Mizaki may have intended that, but God never intended for Chalice Dungeons to be made, and I think he overrules him. 
You are you saying that he allowed something to happen that he didn't want to happen? What's my favorite jam? Raspberry. What's yours? I didn't even know that No Rest for the Wicked comes out today. I was like, yesterday I was like, I want to play Soulsborne tomorrow. One of them from Softy games. And so here I am. And then today, people are like, hey, No Rest for the Wicked. I'm like, what? Oh, shit. Already? All right. I'll get to it someday. Better reviews are mixed. Why are they mixed? Performance or something? Ori fanboys disliking the changes or who mixed them? Yeah, are they are they stirred well? Oh. Shaken, not stirred. Performance mostly? Okay. See, that's the thing is a lot of time performance reviews don't affect me because God tier PC thanks Star Forge hashtag add exclamation point PC. <clears throat> Humble brag. Humble sponsorship. Anus! Double anus. Double. I mean, that's how you get the intestines for sausage, right? Oh God! Uh oh! Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh oh! Hey guys, look what I brought! Sorry, lady. Oh. Yeah, you just insert arm, you grip real hard, pull, there you got your sausage lining, or casing rather. How all proctology exams end, the patient explodes into mist. I had a really long fart while I read that, I'll be honest. It was faded, it was faded to happen. I'm sorry. Thanks for sharing. You're welcome. Well, I didn't share the sound of it, though. I'll fart into the mic next time. You could be a big pig, too. <laughs> but, oh, this is not. Not what I intended. My tendies. Where'd it go? I'll forget everything. There we go. Didn't someone get banned for farting in the mic on stream? I believe it was queefing and it was dumb. Just Google it. Please do not start farting into the mic. Chat will get even more weird. I think it was queefing. There's... Oh. But I met a dude who's on... It who got really popular on Instagram for just sitting there and farting and it was just his fart noises. How much do you tip for farts? I don't know. Ask that dude. Um... 100% believe someone... someone was creeping in the mic. Wait, you, you would Oh. Ah, shit, bag. Better go! Better go! Slicey dicey. Oh, I have 12 insight? What am I doing? Oops. Oh god, huh? Hmm. 
Yeah, it's fine. That's fine. Ay, 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 yeah, pa, 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 pa. Disappear, no? No, 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 stagger, 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 stagger. No, no. Shit. Oh, I gotta run. <laughs> I can only sleep for so long while doing this. Scary. I didn't go put in the good gems. That's why our damage wasn't great. Ha! <laughs> that makes sense. Grimace's birthday when I said what? That fucked the shit out of Grimace. Well, was it? With the purple, the purple, purple drink? Yeah, purple milkshake. That's what it was. Yeah, the Grimace come. Yeah. I can't believe Ronald McDonald himself came out and said that everybody was drinking Grimace Jizz at the end of it. <clears throat> Pretty good. They got him good. Oh. Huh? Oh. Maxed? Oh, I did max. Nice. Should have had so much better damage. Look at that. 50 damage just from that one gem. Let alone another 30 damage. Okay. That would have been a lot more damage. Uh. Oh. What's up, Ticonsar? How's it going? I'm interesting today. Because I'm playing Soulsborne. What can I say? It's how it works. Now we get a little more vitality. It's a little bit more. I'm only interesting when I play Soulsborne. Stop killing her. She's not dying, though. I'm just putting her to sleep. Hmm. Wait. Oh, it's 20 per. I can't believe they made it so expensive, man. I guess they're there, though. They're there. Kid, an appointment so you missed most of the stream. Oh, no! Well, it's always on YouTube, you know, after the fact. I've got Great Ones Wisdoms. Oh, you mean to top off to buy? Yeah, no. I, would, I didn't actually need chunks. I was just observing. That's all. Um... Let's see. Let's DLC? Let's finish this chalice dungeon. Nope, nope, nope. <clears throat> What's up, Alexander Fox? How's it going? Yeah, we're plus 10. We're plus 10. Uh, saw spear. Ah. <sighs> nice. I'll take a stretch break soon. <laughs> oh, 
A run arrives precisely when it means to. Stretch it out. I don't think I don't think we'll check that, Fox. But but there is that, yes. <clears throat> Dum, bum, bum. Deletes dungeon. Now it's finished. <laughs> uh. Hold on, I got one. Oh. What's up, guys? <laughs> What's up, man? What's up? What's up? Now everything is illuminated. It's so bright. That's true. Uh, Halo Buzz, Bloodborne, or Elden Ring? For... Need more context. Bloodborne or Elden Ring as... The, if I only had one to play for the rest of my life? If I... Which one do I think has a better story? Which one looks better? Which one is... Uh-oh. Elden Ring is higher on the list as my, uh, uh, on my favorites list. Oh God, again? For a first date? If I had to kiss one. Elden Ring, definitely, definitely. Uh, think about kissing Bloodborne and what that would entail. Oops. Mm, I'm lost. Oh, wait. Oh, uh, ooh, okay. I didn't remember this dungeon for some reason. In which location of Dark Souls would you kiss Elden Ring? The, uh, um, the, um, Undead Parish, probably? Like, that's probably where I would get married to Elden Ring. This is where I already came, right? Yeah, they got that. Good for me. And is there a door out of there, maybe? I don't think there is. These are usually dead ends. Yeah. But the lever is somewhere else. These are the quick, fast ones, and I'm lost. No, it's just across the bridge and through the other way, right? Surely. Then it's a big room, then there should be another door. Like here. Yeah, there we go. Ah, okay, here we go. Ah, the speedrunner! That's right. This is Bloodborne's homage to speedrunners. From softwares. Naked with a big weapon. Naked with a big weapon. We do have a new shirt design uh, that is almost finished, Lavos. Bang, ba, bang, 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 bang. Whee! It's almost Finnish. It's it's a, it's more Norwegian than Finnish. Stop it. Stop it. It's almost done. Moog is your second favorite boss in Elden Ring, but yeah, you wouldn't trust him with children. I wouldn't trust any Elden Ring boss with children. Or maybe any FromSoft boss ever with children. Except maybe Made in Australia. Maybe. Maybe. Ah! One shot. Oh, 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 oh. Glorious. Oh, no. No. Osiris is one of the few that I would not give any credit towards properly handling a baby or a child. You would trust Snail Warrior. I would trust Snail Warrior. Although, 
Doesn't Maiden have like an ocean of dead babies here? They're plague babies, and I think she birthed them. But also she takes care of them. They're her babies. Yeah. Those are the discarded babies. From her? Are they her discarded babies? Renala raised three kids. Hmm. Yeah, but the circumstances just, I don't know. <laughs> they turned out well, yeah. Oh, I remember this open one. But there's multiple big open ones. I think I go up. Where's the bell lady? There she is. Hey, bellity. Oops. Oh, yeah. Kale could take your kid on donkey rides. And he's got a good income stream, probably. Yeah, that would be a great, a great parent. Oop. One of Renala's kids fed himself to a snake. Well, that's not, that's not her fault. Is it? Young Dagger Dak. Five months. Welcome back. Maria would make sure the child wasn't too curious. Right, right. Little curious is fine, but not too curious. Oh, here we are. Oh, thought it was a multi. Oh, whatever. Allowed on Twitch, by the way. Coralou has a pet cat. Uh, yeah, I'm trying to remember what happened to that cat. Uh, I don't, whoa, tall lady. Show me your face. There you go. Is that like a bunny nose? Is it a furry ghost? It's a pilgrim? Pilgrim. Why are you waiting? Why do your feet look like that? Ah. Whoa, 10 blood vials. I didn't remember that. That's nuts. So many blood vials. Uh-oh. Puke thing. Oh, and a scurrying beast. Oh. She's the blood vial restock. I didn't remember that at all. But that's cool. What? Oh. Okay. born <laughs> well you try huh? points for effort I suppose the Aaron Jaeger throw fireballs oh Jesus do we need a side uh, I don't know chalice dungeons man the one from soft thing that I always still bring a guide for If I've been to the redacted... Oh. No, I haven't. You missed. Oh. I missed. God damn it. 
can't believe we've had a cum command in this chat for like six years. More like three. Probably like three. Hello? Bold hunters, Mark. Are you, look at this little two step he was doing. Oh man! I'm sorry. I interrupted. Hold on, let me diagro. I was in everything. Wait, I'm gonna save and quit. I wanna see his dance again. Wear beard. Um on pirates somewhere. The infinite blood echo chalice, the cum dungeon. Yeah. The fact that it's also a dungeon, like What? Oh, it was you! I thought you were just gonna spawn live here with the blood. Too mold. Hold on, does he see me anymore? How can he see me? Oh, he don't see me, he don't see me. Oh, he does his little two-step! What fine footwork. Look, even the character is cheering cheering for him. Shakira! I don't know if there's a reason for me to be in this dungeon. That's where I came in. Drop down. Ah, I don't know if I'll do Queen Yarnum. She's so deep into the chalice dungeons. It's like doubles the playthrough time to get all the way there, practically. Hello? Hello? Hmm. I like the fight. I don't think it's boring. I think it's quite interesting, in fact. Saw spear? No, why not saw saw? I mean, saw cleaver. I've used a saw cleaver just... Probably 70% of my Bloodborne runs use a saw cleaver. And I maybe have used a saw spear like once. So I decided to use a soul spear. I can't say that I do actually, Persia. I'm sorry. Um, did you finish it? Have I ever fisted? Many times. Are you? Oh, this is hay. Oh, hey. Oh my gosh, we deal so much damage.
attack, guys. Ow. I'm just listening to music. Oh my, uh, fuck. Oh, it's a multi-hit. I didn't know. It's on PS5. has been scratched. Uh, send me details, Persia Prince, for exactly what you've got going on. Send it on Discord or Twitter DM. Both are open if you want. Or if neither of those works for you, you can send them in the email. Lobus Jr. Jamin at Gmail. How far into dungeons we heading? Probably not too far. It was nice to get some watchdog music, though. some bolt hunters marks. I think it's time for DLC and a stretch break. Not for, not necessarily in that order. I'll be right back.
Yeah. One second. I'm gonna try something. Glorpers? Initiate Glorp protocol. Hmm. She's a foolish woman to believe in an outsider. Her brain must be as loose as her crotch. Holy shit, soy. What the fuck? My favorite stretching pose? I don't know the name of it, but you get on all fours. You raise an arm and then you thread through and twist the back. Oh. Very nice. <clears throat> That's a good one. Um, who's the hottest Uber driver you've had? Um, I never went to Uber Jobber. Dun, 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 dun. S is DLC time? Oh, I don't think I got the key. I didn't get the key yet. <clears throat> Hmm. High lunge. You might surmise why I was changing English. Yeah. Cause them English are all soft. <laughs> right? Uh, let's see here. Key! Oh, wait, I do have the key. I do? Oh, I suppose I do. Ah, there's that collapsed pupil. God, I missed it. Don't out me like that. Is there an irregulator for Bloodborne? I don't think... I don't know, actually. I would be interested... Hold on. Here, let's do this. Let's take a look. And the thing is, the thing is, not all Bloodborne mods will necessarily be on Nexus mods, but there are some. Hold on. Let's see. Okay. You're my dad. Boogie, woogie, woogie. Uh, let's see. Um... Oh, look at this. How to install mods for Bloodborne on PS4 and any other game, probably. Well, that's nice. Wait. Where is, where's the game? Oh, I, I meant to search. Wait. Oh, no, this is good. Uh, downloads. Bloodborne Original Weapons. In this mod, I make all characters move sets. The, you make all characters move sets? There you go. There's Bloodborne Randomizer. Great One Beast Restored. I don't think I actually ever did this one. This is a cut boss that you can access. That's in the Chalice Dungeons now. Um, Bloodborne Enhanced. Ah, this is the one that we saw that is a recent. It was updated five days ago, which has different features for, uh, for Bloodborne. Whoa, that's the, uh, the next one's interesting. What does it have? Boss rematches. Restock blood vials and bullets. You can now rest at lamps, like other games like that. Um, unlocked chalice dungeon lever doors, so you can just go th straight through the bosses. That's actually great. I like that a lot. A bunch of fixes. Auto new game plus. Oh, toggling this off will prevent the game from starting New Game Plus immediately, so you can run around in New Game still. Stocked shop, enhanced lamps. There's a lot of stuff in here. Randomizer version? Huh. Oh, so you can attach it to the randomizer. That's cool. This is interesting. Magnum Opus lighting changes. Hmm. Whoa. Big moon. At Wetner's? Ah! Interesting. Could be neat. Different to 
First person camera mod. Oh, could you play it with PSVR? Uh, that's probably a stretch. So I already did, uh, <laughs> I already did Bloodborne monocular zoomed in run. So we basically did first person mod, but that would make it so you wouldn't have to deal with that shit. What the hell is Bloodborne Gizoogle Edition? Adds some gangsta lyric up in yo in-game text. Is that run on YouTube? I'm pretty sure. Lobos Jr. Monocular. There it is. Eight years ago. Eight years ago. The whole run is like this. That's it. The whole run's like that. Is fighting bosses yeah. like this. I'm, I don't know. We're just wailing. In this <laughs> that works. Uh, Yarnum unfiltered. Remove certain post processing effects. Interesting. Lady Dimitrescu of the Astral Talk, talk? Clock Tower. Interesting. Fire Giant Simulator, yes. Back when Lobos was only 65. What else? File and Packers here. Ludwig's Holy Moonlight Sword. Oh, the boss version. Wait, which one's the... This... No, that's the... This is the boss... Oh, that's the boss... Is it different? glowy I guess um well that's it see that's all the Bloodborne mods that are on here but if you check out Glorp Lobby on Dark I'm just kidding if you go to the there's a mod mod server where like this is basically all from software mod stuffs the mod announcements channel shows where when people finish mods, they post them here. And they don't always get posted necessarily to Nexus. Um, and some of them might just be like zip files or whatever. Which, I guess they could be uh, <laughs> potentially malicious, but I'm sure they, mo they, they moderate that. But there's a lot of things here, and sometimes there's just like GitHub files for getting things to run and do certain mods. But anyways... Uh, yeah, so like there's a couple of things, but it doesn't seem like there was, uh, I don't even remember what you asked for in the first place, but did somebody say Glorp got added? Uh oh, <laughs> let's see. Glorpa? Ah, Glorpa, like Corpa. <laughs> Did somebody say Glorp? Jesus Christ. Why is Glorp... Um, why is Glorp? Just, I'm just wondering what... Did some... Who's, who Glorped? The world. What is that? Glorp clap? Glap! Oh, Jesus. <clears throat> I'm refreshing the on-screen chat so that can be updated. I'm going to need to restart. Yeah, it looks like the Toy Story. The claw. Yes. It moves. It has chosen me. Hmm. By the way, Zellback, thank you so much for the 32 months. Hope I got you before. Okay, can I see the chat now? Oops. Give me one moment. I apologize for this delay. Slightly, but I need all of the current Glorp emotes viewable. It looks like I'm good now. Did some, was it, did somebody say Glorp? Oops, I don't know if it's that. Uh, oh, it is that. Ah, oh, that shows up in the chat. Not, not in my chat though. Damn it. Okay, whatever. Anyway, ah. 
gunfire. In any case. DLC! That's what we were doing. Duct Tape Ninja. Glorp. Oh, they're dead now because of this thing, huh? Hi! Cursed Daphines, their children too. And their children forever true. And their children forever true. Do you have to curse him? <clears throat> I bet the kids don't even know what their ancestors did wrong. And you're cursing them? All right, whatever. Generational punishment. Deal with it. Curse the Glorp, their Glorpa too. Hmm. Maybe it's a good curse? Oh. Like, cursed, curse my good looks. They just take a proper history class? Oh, okay, so they, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They'd be like, oh, that's what my grandparents did, so that's why I deserve living a horrible fish man life. Whoop. Ah! Horrible fish man life with a horrible fish woman wife. Beast kata. Curse to have giga abs no matter what. That'd be a nice curse. Giga by giga abs you mean giga anti-lock breaks, right? Oi! That's just Good safety consideration. Ah, barbecue dogs! Ah, oh, shit, I didn't get the item. Barbecue dogs. I got my baby back. Wait, A-L-B-S though, but it's hyphenated, anti-lock, anti-lock brake system, A-B-S, oh Jesus, isn't it, isn't it A-B-S, whatever, the button every car is A-B-S, see that's what I thought. Giga abs, less ability to relax stomach, less ability to breathe deeply with stomach, less stamina in ultra endurance. What are we talking <laughs> Automatic braking system? Maybe that's what it is. Anti-lock bowel syndrome. Uh, wait, isn't that good though? Do you do you want your bowels to get locked? I don't want them. You got one big ab? Nice. That's all I need. One big ab muscle. them all. Six pack, not nah, whole keg. Oh! Hmm. Uh -oh. 
Oh 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 I love the timed Molotovs. I never use them though. Delayed Molotov. Oh! Uh. I was on my thumb. I thought I could. Oh, ticks. Ticks! Nice blood vials here. Ow. Ow. The gun that always double taps. Is this when the game switches to Pizza Cutter one Run? Um. Either that or safe. <laughs> the old symbol spam. Anyone ever hit their funny bone on purpose? <sighs> ah, okay, fuck. Uh, I did. Ow. <laughs> Jesus. <clears throat> like I tased my elbow just now. You're a hunter. Well, this is... You've seen this is a... a ne Nightmares are fascinating. Oh, yes. You sense a secret within the nightmare and cannot bear Besides, to leave it be. I'm really living As life now. As if the spirit now. of Bergenworth lives on within you. Such inquisitive hunters will relish the nightmare. But beware. Secret, especially when the secrets are. Don't tase your elbow anymore, though. I stopped. Isn't self-harm against toss? Well, I am playing Bloodborne, so... Now that's funny! <laughs> Licking rocks for geology. I would do it. Wait, lick... Wait, rocks or... Right, geology, rocks. Yeah, okay. I got my baby back. Yes, barbecue dog. There you go. Ow! What the fuck? You lick rocks every day, it's called salt. Shit. It still sucks to hit your non humorous bone. Oh. Dogs. No! Damage. Oh, pretty good. We got a lot of skill. Nice. Ow. Stop. Bird dogs. Lavos, fun fact request. Okay, hold on. Make sure no dog birds are on the way. Fun fact, let's see. <clears throat> uh, damn. When Felix Baumgartner set a world record for skydiving in 2012, he broke the sound barrier, reaching a speed of 833.9 miles per hour. Like, just fucking zooming as a person? Just his body? Broke the sound bit. Is there a video of that? You didn't see it? I didn't. He just did it. This says 2012. Um. Okay. I want to do the skip. Please check and let's watch. It was extremely cool. Hold on. Let's see, I think you go to the next one. Is that right? Oops. Or is it just that first one? He just broke the sound barrier just like that. Oh, he just did it. I get you. <laughs> uh, yeah, he just did it. Oh, what the fuck? Ooh. 
Live updated book. No way. Oh, God damn it. Get out. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do this. <clears throat> I think it's just the first one. What is happening? I did it the first try and now. Do you roll it? I. I. Mmm. If only there were instantly updatable media sources. <sighs> Man, if only. Do the jump, do the roar. How did I do, how did I do that? How do you request a fun fact? Uh, over on Twitch, you have to accrue points by watching the stream, channel points. I Maybe you have to roll. And so you redeem those fun facts with points. They take a while to do because otherwise, there we go. Wait, oh wait, do you do it again? Hmm. Roll seems to be definitely the way, but do I, can I do it twice? Or do you land on the, maybe you land on the, the wooden thing. Good morning, Mr. Jumper! No, oh, don't rumble in my face. Hold on. No sh Patience! I'm not even sure if you can jump, like, through geometry once you're there. Like, maybe you can, but also... If you encourage more Gamba, then Chat can lose all their points and you won't have to read as much. You just want to win more points so you can make me read more, is that right? I get it. Oh, oh, oh! SM Eclipse, 67 months. We doggy, back to Bloodborne. Yeah, we're here. But you can't get up that way, so that's just to get early. Just double jump with Torrent. Dude, Torrent would get so fucked up in this world. Hmm. All right, safe. Beast safe hunter. Non, non ya, non ya business. Bad idea, bad idea. Nice. Oh, that's not even off of him. Beast Hunter safe. Saif. Saif. That's what it was. You spent your hard earned point for a Shakespearean insult. Pardon me. I was fighting a, a hunter. Did you see that? Dolric. All right. Let's see if your hard-earned 
channel points were worth it. Are you ready? This is not an insult. This is an insult towards me. Is that... It is also a 1 out of 5 burn rating. But the insult to me is I am pigeon-livered and lack gall. Well, that's not that's not how insults work. Hold on, we're doing we're doing another one because we gotta insult you. You suck, man. Wait, I think I've read this one before. Uh oh, did these get out of order? Uh oh. <laughs> uh, Fallen Theorem, welcome back, Dolorik. A rare parrot teacher. Parrot teacher. Remember that one. Is that the are you are you burned? Did you get burned? Oops. Huh? Holy smacka. Okay, time to go, time to go, time to go. Don't do it. Oh. No refunds. Finished two 20 second ads just to hear that. Oh shit. Was it worth it? <laughs> You'll never recover from that one. Uh, parrot teacher. <laughs> oh. Um. Yeah. Where's the... I've been going back and forth. We tried to sell these old Blink cameras that we haven't used in forever, but they're tied to an account that I no longer have the email for, and we've been back and forthing for like four days trying to get the, the cameras disconnected from our account. I want my blood vials back. Be right back. And, so, and they're messaging again. <sighs> Where's that quote from, Fenor? <laughs> that was a genuine message about Lobos's wiki thing, huh? Blink cameras? What? Do they only take 182 show? Band. DLC time finally, boss. Y'all ready? Y'all ready? IMDb, my brother's page. Oh, nice. <laughs> Who writes these things? Who writes these? Is it you? Look at all these files. Friend! Five vials every time. Headbutted. All right. Crank your speakies. Y'all ready? Should we do base boosted Ludwig? No, I'm not gonna overblow it like we do with Storm King. Storm King's ridiculous. There we go. Oh, oh please help us. Ruined, Sir Squirrel.
side all along. We're just listening to the music. It's always. Never want to kill these bosses. Good fast. hunter. Hello. Have you seen the thread of light? Just a hair, a fleeting thing. Yet I clung to it, steeped as I was in the stench of blood and beasts. I never wanted to know what it really was. Really, I didn't. Oh, 
Peter McCarrot. Jammin, 4785, and General Digdongus. Welcome back. Setting this as your ringtone? Nice. Do I have a... I do have some church garb. Does that give the dialogue? Tell me. Yes. Good hunter of the church, have you seen the light? Are my church hunters the honorable Spartans? I hoped they would be. Ah, good. I say no a lot. That is a relief. To know I did not suffer such denigration for nothing. Yeah. Thank you kindly. Now I may sleep in peace. Even in this darkest of nights, I see the moonlight. Rippus. He said moonlight. Yeah. He's gonna be like looking uh, up from hell and like. That son of a bitch lied to me! One second. What's the Moonlight Sword description again? An arcane sword discovered long ago by Ludwig. When blue moonlight dances around the sword and it channels the abyssal cosmos, its great blade will hurl a shadowy light wave. Holy Moonlight Sword is synonymous with Ludwig the Holy Blade, but few have ever set eyes on the great blade, and whatever guidance it has to offer it seems to be of a very private, elusive sort. I have a bunch of things to sell. <sighs> Goodbye. Goodbye. Um... I'll pass. We'll just keep what we got. Uh, I don't have claw mark. Uh, equipped. Ah, oh, shit. I probably. I probably, uh. Overwrote one with the other. There we go. What? There. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. See, so had Ludwig OSC on repeat for three hours. Dedication. Short ritual root chalice. Yes. Pungent blood cocktail. Big pungy blood cock. The house is not actually always on fire. Not until you kill Mergo's wet nurse, which is near near the end of the game. Uh, when I, if you're aiming for more echoes, you can rebuy stuff if you want later. Oh, no, it's good. I won't, there won't be a later. <laughs> this is like, I don't really play characters more than one playthrough, unless it's a slow run. Peep had a character who was basically a looter and lore wise found the moonlight sword, but didn't know how to activate it. So just use the untransformed form. Chad would always go bonkers and cream at him for not using the transformed form. Hmm. By night, Please don't cream at me, chat. That's funny. 
But at least he wasn't disappointed by transforming it and then going, what the hell? This does no damage. It looks cool, but it does no damage. Since he probably didn't have a, an arcane build. Creaming at peeve. Cream Abdul Jabbar. <sighs> God bless. Mm. No half and half. Either fully cream or nothing at all, please. Cream the Lobos. Those, those emotes don't... <laughs> the stacking of emotes don't work for my chat thing. But I can always check the Twitch chat. Yeah, that... Oh, you're drowning me. You're drowning me in that. Uh... Beware of the frailty of men. There will be so weak. Brewmaster Beer Brewing Simulator from my wish list is now on sale. Nice. Nice. Speaking of which, we we just got in a whole bunch of stuff to to make some cider. So I got to make some cider. I have 170,000 blecos. I need to go spend. Hey, love us new to the stream. What's Twitch chat? You. That's you. Collective. Do I have all my gems in place? Just making sure. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I do. Right? The 15er? 18, 15, 18. Yeah, all right. Long time commenter, first time watcher. Interesting. What would you comment on? Without watching. If you want to buy Bloodborne on PS5, which version should you buy? I don't think it... Do you mean physical or digital? I get digital these days if I have the space. And, le and, and if I want physical because I want physical, I get that on the side as like a collector's item. Cool. Oh, God. These guys. I'm blue. I'm gonna sneak past you guys. I'm gonna sneak past you guys. I'm gonna sneak past you guys. Don't oh. look at me. I'm sneaky. I'm like a sneaky cream. You mean there's a greatest hit version and a version with DLC? The greatest hit version doesn't come with DLC. Get the DLC, uh, oh my God. Definitely get the DLC, that's all I can say. And then from there, whichever one's cheaper at that point. If you can buy the DLC without the game, do that. Why is that? Yeah. 80 month subscriber, first time Glorper God! Glorper God. Please don't smash me with your IV. Oh God. Ah, you did it! Walking up to a stranger on the street. Hey, do you know I am a tier three sub on three different channels? They're pretty much gonna... Oh! They are uh, pretty much obligated to have sex with you right there. The drama screwing you over continues. What? <clears throat> Sinister Resonant Bell. Is that like the evil version of Taco Bell?
I don't think I want to eat there. Do you think the IV would be a quality weapon? No, it would absolutely be blood tinge. Duh. Eh? Huh? Oh, in this way. Taco Bell is the evil version. Ah, uh, wait, evil is combination Pizza Hut and Taco Bell? What? Why? They usually have like an arcade too. And by usually, I mean the one that I've ever been to. There was a KFC Taco Bell Pizza Hut. It had KFC as well. How's that evil? Splish, splash. Splish, splash. Have you heard how curiously the sea churns? Like a storm, but like the rain, only gentle, like dripping water. Water. It bellows from deep inside of me. Here it comes, up through my inside, but <clears throat> gently, like little droplets. I'm just imagining the audition for this. They're like, all right, give us like your most like sultry, like uh, sensual voice. And then they audition and they're like, great, you got the part. She's like, yeah, what am I voicing? Flesh blob. Oh Literal brain fluid mass. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Huh? Do what? I did the thing, didn't I? I'll probably fight they can't they Flesh Blob talking about their insides. <laughs> oh shit. Clip plop. Clip clip plop. Oh. Do you think the lady that you think that the lady that voiced that blob ever played Bloodborne? It's hard to be it for clarity. Learn to see past exteriors. Ow! Holy shit, he full shamboed me. Rochambeau'd me. <clears throat> How could she play Bloodborne? She is a flesh blob. I think it's still fine, because I think I unlocked the this, didn't I? Yeah, we're good. Flatulated to death. Most of the VA credits for this are from children's TV. Really? Do you mean, do you mean like child actors or they're actors that, that act on children's TV programming? What's up, crunch time? Adult actors in children's TV programming. That's great. So they went from like, let's count to three. One, two, three. To like, I feel it bubbling up in my insides. Oh. The flesh, he calls to me. Oh. Whee! I like that too, Soy. Patches has been in a ton of cartoons. Nice. I have failed. Please, Lady Maria. <laughs> I have failed. Please, Lady Maria. No reaction, huh? All right. It's time for Twitch chat. 
Dumb jokes, dreamer. Everybody's already made that joke. Hello? to listen to the music it's too late I got the souls in the item here I'm just gonna stand up I'm just gonna I'm just gonna stand in here while this plays. sounds in the video? Act like I'm fighting? Oh, okay, hold on. guys is it bugged the sounds so authentic these sounds are definitely happening happening can you jump that fence I don't think so but I'll try There it is. Are they in the video? Or? I gotta hide, they're doing the meteors.
and they're dead. We win! Sella, thanks for gifting five subs! Appreciate you. GG, first try, zero damage taken. Amazing. Ten more till the funny number, Aura. Oh, shit. Link 1024. I missed your resub. I'm so sorry. Welcome back. Uh, and Mexi Maya. Wolfpack Support Plus sub there. Thank you so much. More vitality. Like we need it. Oh. I forgot. It's immediately music again. Ready? But why? It's faster. That's why. It's from Soft's fault. They put the leveling behind like seven lines of dialogue. Gigachin. A corpse should be left well alone. Oh, uh, okay. Our character oh, is just I'm blue Willem well. Dafoe. How the secrets beckon so sweetly. Only an honest death will kill you now. Liberate you Holy. from your wild curiosity. Don't 
kiss me. Don't kiss me. Which, which one's the grab? That. Don't kiss me. I just wanted her to grab me. I'm sorry. I didn't. I can't even see that there was a uh, prediction. So, don't think that I threw for for reasons. Rip points. Uh, doubters rejoice. The, is it the one where she does this and leans forward? She crosses and then. Which one's the grab? I wanted her to kiss me. Yes. Oh god. Shut up. Shut up. Oh, really? As soon as I turn away. Oh, I'm pressing the wrong button to pick up.
Grab me! Grab me! Do it! Oh, that's not a kiss. <laughs> that's a heart. Borrow. She borrowed my heart. Okay. Game shot. Not not impressive at all, but sometimes you just gotta you gotta 360 free aim. Nerf dart too weak. <laughs> ah. Playing with my food. Nah, she can she can legit like combo me in that last phase. She, get, she has some nasty hitboxes too. Hello, good I'm not very good at dodging completely there. Uh, Vitality. That's probably all I need. Ooh, almost level 69. Are you weird for upgrading your gun even though you're not leveling blood tinge? No, I always upgrade my gun. Though I've been slacking on this this playthrough. Because you always have like extra upgrade mats anyways. Look at this. See, it's plus five. Or it's plus... Yeah. It was plus five. You kind of wish your fight went on just a bit longer. What, like two health bars worth? I need to get rid of my insight. Also put my hat on. Oh, wrong hat. This progress is getting the astral clock tower, celestial dial, garage door opener. Well, I've hit kind of a wall because um, that would cost a lot of money. So basically, I haven't done anything yet with that. <laughs> One day, maybe. Once we win that Powerball, baby. We win that Powerball. Custom house with custom garage door, clock tower face. And then my front door is the thing from Old Duar, giant massive gate door that opens up as well. And then the, there's no house, because that's where all the money goes. I haven't played the Bloodborne board game in a long time. Nay, I do not play it regularly. I have a bunch of box board games that... Yeah, I should get the blood... I should get board game streams going again. They're a lot of... There's a, they're a bit of work, but they're fun. And... Uh, I've definitely got the games to play. We've got the Monster Hunter board game still boxed up, just waiting. Is this whole game just a dream? I don't know, is it? Big enough. 
big as that. You want Eternal Ring 2. No, I've never played Dominion. I have Kingdom Death. Monster or whatever. Still, still in the box. Untouched. Just waiting. Fiends. Atonement for the wretches. By the wrath of Mother Cos. Mercy. For the poor wasn't child. Mercy. Oh, please. Nope. WWE, no mercy. You heard that the Bloodborne board game is too hard? Uh, I don't remember. Pretty much every game that I've ever played that had any sort of Lovecraftian influence or focus was really hard to win. <laughs> well, it's kind of... It's kind of a staple. I mean, every From Software game is difficult, so why would the board game be easy? Uh oh Skellies. When you say hard about board game, do you mean RNG heavy or do you need to get lucky? Probably, uh, yes. Well, those two things are the same thing, kind of, I think. But the answer is probably yes. The significance of costs in this story. Koss is the bloated corpse that Orphan pops out of. That's why he's Orphan of Koss. Not getting the Rakuyo? I'll fight some sharks. You want me to fight some sharks, huh? Harrowed set, of course. Yeah, that DLC look. Costs from space. I don't know. Could be. You thought the boss was called the Orphan of Cosm. Mm. I did play Echo the Dolphin, and I did a podcast episode on it too. I also co uh, covered. Music. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, ah. Uh, ah. Uh, ah. Uh, from. Oh, uh, hold on. Echo the Dolphin 2. Um. Alright, here we go. Hold on. Yum yum. I'm gonna do a little bit of that too. Get him! Yeah, you do, but I was just already there. Okay. What's up, Mega Parsa? Parry him. Mm. You get him to half health, and then he usually walks off and aggro's the other one. That's why I shaman bone blade, but it was too late. Shaman bone bladed. Yeah. 
Does the other one just drop down? No, it is based on HP. Come to the side, bro. We need Shark Pirate Area and Elden Ring DLC. I'm sure we'll get some sort of equivalent. for sleep poison swamp for Elden Ring DLC yeah isn't the grab when she parries you Ooh, Count Kaiser I think you are about 17 minutes behind the live stream might want to pause and play <laughs> it sucked at blood level 4 let alone right. oh we did it he's got. Okay, now Shaman Bone Blade, bitch. Don't. Yeah, there we go. I couldn't even video game. <laughs> Trying to slay that shark pussy. It would, I probably should just stick with and not even go for Shaman Bone Blade strats. I just find it more Interesting. I've only got one more try with the Shaman Bone Blade anyways. So. Whatever. Oops. Do not dodge left with these guys. As he dodges left. As he continues to dodge left. I'm just telling, I'm just telling you guys what to do. There we go. Now, would you decide not to fuck duck my sack back? That I, I didn't even hit him. All right. Okay. I didn't even use the item. Whichever one makes it through first. There you go. Well. Where'd the other one go? <laughs> Where? Is he dead? What the fuck? What am I doing? I don't know. Where'd the other one go? How did it die? I. I didn't shaman blow it, bone blade it before. Unless I had two shaman bone blades. I misunderstood. Well, the friendly fire only works if you uh, if you bone blade them. That's what. Ew. The whole reason I was doing it. Who's singing? Uh, mom. There you go. Got scared. 
His shift was up and he went home. Ah, oh, that's how it works. The old like 6 p.m. shift transition. Does Bone Blade have a chance of not breaking? I don't think it breaks even. You just stab it into them. I don't know. Maybe there was a weird like timing thing where I did hit him and I didn't use it. I don't know. <laughs> you got me. Yeah, good old winter la winter lanterns. Oh yeah. Well, it seemed like there was something similar in Elden Ring DLC. Not to fully spoil. Oh god. Ah, reminds me of my old dorm, my old dorm noises. Oh shit. Lanterns moved in faster than they do. You'd consider them extreme ass. They're pretty fast once they start chasing you. Hello. Oh, no, no, no. It's the overhead. No. Oh. Well, I always do this. Oh, what are you doing, mate? Uh, the overhead. Block. Oh, it wasn't a block. It was his. He's made of lead right now. That's the one. That's the one I was thinking of. It's like an old lady who heard there's a sale at the grocery store fast to you. That's incredibly fast. Have you seen the science behind that? The adrenaline? Fueled into their legs? He's made of lead poisoning? That would be bad for him. But I don't think it is. Ken Coldblood. Final Fantasy Origins. No. No, I did not. Whee! Oh, God. When is Bloodborne Origins? It's probably on the... Who is it? Probably on the, um, uh, Cisco? No. To the Cisco console? Nope. Wasn't Cisco, was it? I don't know. What is blood? Baby, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. No more. Ah, the Soldier Boy. Yeah, that's it. The Soldier Boy console. Oh, God. All right. Yeah. It's go time. The only song I know by Cisco is the thong song. That's it. But that's all you need to know. 
because it's the best song ever written. Bloodborne 2 releasing on the Soldier Station. Could you imagine some sort of exclusive like that? Sashi Buri Dada. Baby. There's Koss. That's Koss. Or Cosm. The steam is such a nice touch. I mean, nice. yeah. space one second <laughs> so he's doing he's just staring off it's probably what I would do too honestly um Let me res respond to this email real quick. by the oldest debate in the debate book. Okay. Brother. Me. 
one back. I remember now. Oh, I forgot that. I forgot that. Oh, right. What am I doing? I almost skipped the cutscene. Bottomless curse. Ah. Sweet child of Kos. Returned to the ocean. A bottomless curse. A bottomless sea. Accepting of all that there is and can be. Profound. Sounds like German. Baby is German. Something, something. German. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Almost got Jersey Michaels for dinner, but decided on spicy chicken sandu instead. Uh... Bye. Sorry. Yeah, sorry. I got some endurance. <gasps> I passed 69, rip. All right, one more little boss boy. One more little bossy poo. Well, in the DLC, I mean. More bosses in the regular game. Have you eaten all your umbilical cords, chat? No, uh, no Shabriri grapes until you've eaten all of your umbilical cords. Shrouded by night. Fact! Call of my blood, but always clear of mine. Fact from Span 22B. We sure curse and curse the shackle. Only the true blades of the church. He's giving you the facts right now. No, we're about to go fight Lawrence. Hmm. Hurricanes? I think I've read that one before. 
To cook an egg, a sidewalk needs to be 158 degrees Fahrenheit or 70 degrees Celsius. Keep that in mind. Uh, there we go. Shut up, guy. Shut up. Cook an egg. That seems bullshit. Uh, it's, uh... Do you think it needs to be less hot or like less sidewalk? Yee! Bye. You could slow cook an egg on a lower temp sidewalk for sure. I mean, not me because no egg, but somebody. That's fair. Does that not go for everything? The cooking uh, temperature? No, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, you could probably slower cook things at lower temps, but maybe they suck? I don't know. <laughs> I didn't write those facts. Don't ask me. Hmm. Hunter's Knight. Let's go. I think this is... Mm, I think... The, I think Lawrence is probably my favorite track in the game now. Uh, well, he's, he's elevated a lot more. But Lawrence, German, Ludwig. Cleric Beast. Gascoigne's great, but... I don't consider it up there. Pasta with some cheese, maybe fettuccine. I'll put some ground sausage on my plate. Oh, shit. It's time. Wait, the lyrics are different? What? I hope you guys enjoy music. This is my first playthrough since last May. But it's probably like my 75th playthrough overall. Hit him in the arm there. Oops. 
sorry. Fall guys? <laughs> this is fall guys. Baby spaghetti with some salad and a nice tea. All right, here we go.
I love this interactive soundtrack. It's such a good... You know, I always listen to music and I'm like, I wish I could play like a little bit of a game to that or something. It's so nice. They give you something to do while listening to it. Does Elder Ring have anything close to this? I don't remember if it does. Elder Ring has some very good music. Moog is very good. I think what it is about a couple of these songs, Lawrence and Ludwig, they have like these particular moments that are Omega climax peak. Whereas like a song like Moog's is great, but it's like it's great across the whole song and there's no moments where it's like, holy shit. Radon's pop. Radon's, I, yeah, I admit I haven't listened to Radon's very much because I'm not very good at his phase two. So I usually try and just make sure I get through it <laughs> and survive. And I also, with the proper build, usually skip a lot of phase two. But yeah. Um, it's rare to get that far in Radon's, yeah. And I did all these DLC bosses NG plus seven fist only, where we had to hear them loop over and over. And that really built a fondness for, for some of this music. Uh, oh, whoops. That's not what I meant to do. Oh, well. Did you that Kingdom Come Deliverance 2 was announced? Yeah, we watched it on stream earlier today. We watched it all. Please save your, your hottest bangers for your strongest bosses. What about your strongest bangers for your hottest bosses? Eight hours of Ludwig attempts? It was total like 17 hours or something like that. It was like three streams. Those two. <laughs> That's how I imagine that emote sounds like. Yeah, those two. Yeah, boss tracks and Shadow of the Earth Tree. So, I mean, if, if Elden Ring was your first FromSoft game and you're, you're kind of new to the series, oh my god. DLCs are like where they where the developers go crazy that's so that's why everybody is so excited for dlc content it's like that's the the most of the game the majority of the game's there now they just polish and make really good shit smaller even though elden ring's probably still going to be really big uh dlc that is it's going to be nuts nuts Where's DLC timer? Here you go. I'll give it to you right here. 63 days, 6 hours, 27 minutes, 30 seconds. Godric's got some great music. Godric's got some great music. Elden Ring definitely has a lot of bangers. But, yeah. Lawrence and Ludwig. I think, like, Lawrence's theme in particular is such a build-up. Build-up to, like, one moment, and then it... <laughs> and you're like, oh, I can breathe again. And then it's slow ramp, 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 build. Huge Omega Pog. And then back down again. Whereas Elden Ring stuff is more consistently just kind of like... A it, it does more smaller waves. A little smaller waves. Um, yeah, I like Godskin music even though it is just take take me out to the ball game. Uh, I'm going to Upper Cathedral Ward. That's where I'm going. You have four builds sitting in Moog's Arena waiting for a DLC. That's what I'm going to do after the month of May, which is our St. Jude month, all the crazy mod runs and stuff we're going to do. Um, once we get into June and we, we, we head towards DLC time, I'm just gonna prep DLC characters. Probably like, yeah, like three or four of them. Um, like a strength base. My first one is just gonna be a knight, you know. My, my typical starter um, setup. Sword and board, kind of medium-ish armor, but with a decent endurance level, so. Oh God. A decent knighty armor. Will there be DS2 during St. Jude month? It's possible. DS2 does not get a lot of mod love because it is architectured differently from the rest. 
So where a lot of knowledge and tools that go into modding are somewhat transferable between DS1, Elden Ring, DS3. Dark Souls 2, I believe, is built wholly differently. I don't know that for a fact, but that's what I think. And DS2 has some good mods, too. Um, but they're really... It's got randomizers. They just kind of work a little differently. It's just a little awkward, I guess. Um, but, like, El like, Elden Ring is still the star right now. And getting a ton of mod stuff for it. Hello. Uh, right, eh. Just snuck right past that guy. Whoop. DS2's best mod is Scholar of the First Sin. <gasps> nice, Sony Roshni. Or Sun Iron. Never mind, Sony Roshni. That's why I stick with that. <laughs> Sony Roshni. You listen to Redon's OST a lot? Oh, shit. Why mod a perfect game? That's probably what all the modders are thinking. Why mod it? It's already perfect. First time you ran around this game with high insight? Yeah, I was thinking about that as I approached these guys, because I think it's 15 insight to enable some new abilities for some of the enemies. Such a small little thing. That you wouldn't really notice. Oh, yeah, for sure, Soy. I, I don't ignore them. I just... There's a lot less than the other games. I, I would expect that over time, more tools and, and normalization of DS2 mods... Modding... Would become available. I mean, what's the DS2 mod we... Play... Oh. We played a DS2 mod not long ago, I thought. That had a bunch of added areas and shit. Hello. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Well, by not long ago, I mean in the last year or two. That was uh, crazy. Can we get a like a frame by frame for that flip there? Is that the one Tiger made? Maybe. This is the survival horror zone, and I love it. Anytime anybody asks my favorite area, this is what I say. It's just, it's, it's cool. Crappy. Ow. Jump scares. Creepy music. Majula in 4K. If this is survival horror, the player is the monster. Well, if they're a, uh, if they're an experienced player, sure. Who just finished the DLC has got DLC gear and maxed out equipment. Yeah, sure. Whatever. Oh, three of them. What's up, guys? How y'all doing? Whoa. The audio. Burn, baby, burn. That all? That all of them right there? I got them all. Gonna put them on my above my fireplace. Under the water. Oh Jesus. I must pee. I will be right back. Don't let anything scary happen, okay?
Anything spooky happen? <clears throat> I should have jump scared y'all. No, I shouldn't have. Uh, let's see here. All right. Yelorp, Olorp, Erlorp, Plorp, Wolorp. Huh? Is this what happens when I AFK? You just go on a glorp emote adding fest? Glorpfest.com. I mean, glorp, glorpcon. Whatever. Ah, shit! Suck me less! Suck me less! Suck me less than you would if I didn't mash. Thank you. Yo, what's up, Dash Retro? Thanks for the raid. Oh, that's an awkward thing to say after a raid. Anyways, um. Oh, I got. I missed Suave Sloth. Are you still there, Suave Sloth? I'm sorry, I missed your question about multi streaming. And I use an OBS plugin. Um. Hmm. If you search OBS plugin, like dual stream. It looks kind of shady. It's just like a GitHub program. Uh, plugin files. But it works. It works. And you can set different. Mm, different qualities for either. Which, by the way, in case you joined the stream and you, ha uh, you're, you haven't been here in a while. Ow. Pretty much all stream content, almost all stream content, is now dual streamed to YouTube. 1440p, 25,000 KB bitrate. Whereas Twitch is limited to 6,000 bitrate. So I just do 1080p, 6K over here. So the AV1 beta isn't AV1 yet. It's not AV1 yet. It, right now, the beta is multi-streaming with different trans codes. So basically, me streaming multiple qualities out to Twitch. But it should hopefully lead to down the line some better encoding uh, to allow for higher quality streams and eventually higher resolutions. But yeah. Because that would save on Twitch, right? Having to do all that transcode processing. Take my original stream Convert it down to different qualities and then show the viewer. Which should improve latency as well. Uh, Under Twitch can offset the streams going to the streamer. Uh, to the support hacker, right? Yeah. I mean, I think that's uh, the goal. A goal. Make Chontach. Can I jump down here? I didn't fight Parl yet, no. I thought about it while I was running through Yahar Ghul. But I didn't. Didn't fight him yet. <laughs> Little King's fine, they're just making contact. Northern Lad Sean, 23 months. Welcome back. Yeah. <clears throat> Can you imagine if there was a parl with flesh fight in the DLC? I would imagine it looks like Blood Starved Beast, but bigger and more monkey. I miss your gift sub. Maybe. Probably. 
but I saw it. Thank you for gifting that sub, Measle. To Dash Restro. Retro. Uh-oh. Time for the most challenging fight this side of the Mississippi. Are you ready? Oh my god. <laughs> well. <laughs> uh. mm. okay. Beast blood pellets, by the way. Dark Beast Parl's internal file name is Ancient Storm Beast. Nice. That's pretty uh, pretty good description of him, I'd say. I thought you were gonna say it was Dank Beast Parl, but <sighs> one can hope. Level seventy-two. Time for one of my favorite designs in all of Soulsborne. Miss Ibritus. Ebri Ebrietas. Ebrietas. Smashing through the window to realize you were upstairs from the Amelia fight was very cool moment. Mm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Smash. What if it was originally just Carl? Carl Winslow from Family Matters? And they had the model and everything. <laughs> Removing behind of your disc to attack the first time, not knowing it was the front. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Did I do that? Yeah, this... When you see this thing, you're like, what the fuck? This sure do seem like a front, I guess. Maybe. Shit! You bastard. <laughs> Ruined. Oh, I know. Uh, I'm not using these blood pellets. I. I okay. I, I'm le I'm getting off. I'm getting off. I don't want it to die so fast. Walk to the right. This one gets good, but it takes a while.
see where I try to usually try to cut the music there, but oh, that's it. Not on time. Shut up! I tried. Okay, she did a weird attack, and I had to get away. Failing Marcel, 76 months. I like Bloodborne. <clears throat> uh, okay, all right. Well, I'm afraid with the time left, I don't have enough time to do many bosses, but I do want to make sure we do Moon Presence so we can get some ease. So l uh, let me go get the last umbilical cord. Um... <clears throat> Which is how you do the video game. It, it's, uh, you go from, uh, you, uh, oh, you gotta run through the woods and back up. Where the woods at? Where the woods at? The woods at? Beast Blood Pellets did their thing. Yeah, Beast Blood Pellets are ridiculous. They are ridiculous. The Beard Lobos is cursed. Well, so is Beard Lobos. Beard Lobos is also cursed. The Flogut is cursed. That's bad. But it comes with a free topping. Ooh, that's good. The topping is also cursed. The topping is also cursed. That's bad. But it's fat free. Ooh, that's good. The topping contains mono super glyceride. I don't remember what it was. Oh, Simpsons. Oh, Simpsons. Happy Chappy NZ. Is that from New Zealand? Can I go now? Yeah. 30 months. Welcome back, Happy Chappy. You like Beardless Lobos? Beardless Lobos is the best. Well, I'm not beardless right now. I am only semi-bearded. No, I did not finish Arch Thrones. I stopped because I was like, this is more than I wanted to find out in a demo. And I'm going to wait for it to fully come out before I continue it. But it was great. It was great. That's, that's a massive demo. Every Thursday at 5, there's a Twitch channel that plays a VHS recording of the episode that aired 30 years ago. 90s commercials and all. Whoa. Nice, happy chappy. It's probably like 7 in the morning there or something. I don't know what time. I'll, I'm going to visit New Zealand someday. I will do it. <clears throat> One more Bloodborne fact. Mergo's wet nurse. Alpha file name was Succubus. Interesting. Seems like they had some lore ideas developing later. In What's wrong with Old Zealand? Old Zealand is still uses rotary phones. What is the original Zealand? I don't know. Doesn't zeal usually have a negative connotation of being like, you know, fanatic fanaticized? Over overly fanatical about the thing? Do we want Zealand? What about like like Cheerland? That balance. Yeah, it, uh, the demo for Arch Thrones really felt like I was missing upgrade materials. Uh, or they were missing me, or, <laughs> or the bosses just had a lot of health. Which is fine, because I like, I like needing to learn a boss properly in order to defeat it, but in some cases it can be, oh boy. God, I'm nauseous. Oh boy. Are you from New Zealand? Have you found this? It's progressing. I can see things. What do you see? I knew it. I'm different. I'm no beast. I... Oh, God, it feels awful. 
but it proves that I'm chosen. No, oh, good for you. Don't you see how they writhe, writhe inside my head? It's rather rapturous. Uh, <laughs> no, I don't see that. God, oh, right. Sorry. Yeah, I need your baby. Sorry. Uh, well, your baby uh, supply line, I guess, instead. <clears throat> My first name is not Jesus, Little King, but... Oops, slipped. She took more than Somali, I think. I... She got worms in there. Don't... What? <clears throat> uh... Time to consume child pipe. Child pipe. Where'd it go? Oh, I have two child child pipes. Audit myself. What? It's a <laughs> Is that Is it offensive to call it a child pipe? You don't even eat them. Well, I think, I think you do. Don't add that quote. <laughs> what? It's like a tube that provides nutrients from mom to child via the child pipe. <clears throat> but in this case, it's an alien one. So I, we can alien child pipe. Is that better? Uh, die. <laughs> it's music time. Dear, oh dear. What was it? The hunt? The blood? Or the horrible dream? Oh, it doesn't matter. It always comes down to the hunter's helper to clean up after these sorts of messes. Tonight, Gammon joins the hunt.
small piece of trivia, I think. Uh, if you didn't know, I actually worked on the official Bloodborne game guide and wrote some boss guides. As part of that, I learned some cool things. That ability that he uses where he explodes is called... I think it's called Look to the Moon. And uh, he always looks at the moon and then he explodes. You have that guide! Yeah. I worked on the newer version. I wrote most of the regular, like, boss guides, I think. I think I wrote a DLC as well. Prepare your ease! Prepare your ease. GG. Our Palafox, welcome back. Thank you so much. S. Clemson, 60, 65 cool? days sober. Very nice. Thank you for 22 months of support. Hope you enjoyed the blood bowling. <laughs> oh, we're a kid, we're a squid now. Oh, good hunter.
All right, my friends, I'm going to leave you here for the day. Maybe tomorrow we'll check out uh, No Rest for the Wicked, since everybody was asking anyways, and that's I didn't realize it was coming out so soon. So We'll plan on that. Saturday we got our Demon Souls slow run continuing. I'll let Lady sing you guys out. Thanks for showing up. Hope you have a fantastic finale to your week. We'll see you in the next one.